Am I streaming? Am I streaming? Wait. Let me check. Let me check. Streaming? Am I streaming? Okay. Oh. <laughs> I hear my own voice. Give me a second. Yes, we are. Let me just update the Discord. We're live. Okay. So, our goal today is to set up our base, like, proper, proper. We do have uh, a generator, right? And all we're going to do is just... Well, we do have how to use generators. Now we just gotta set up our actual perimeter of our base. So let's get into Zomboid. Zomboid screen. We set this up. Properties. Yep. Should be the right screen. Also, we set up the music real quick. For three days, I think my neck has been kind of killing me because <laughs> I was uh, sleeping in my hometown, right? And I was sleeping on the floor, but I think uh, since it's somewhere that I'm not used to, I just kind of like sprained it a little bit. Bam. What are we doing? Guess we gotta set up a water collector or something. Power is off. Uh, well, power is on. But it's because we're using a generator right now. Yo, Mitmiff, what's up? It has been a while, my friend. We are back in Zomboid. And yeah. Just gotta set up our base. So I'm thinking like uh, we have a lake, right? Time to spread Polish propaganda. Let's go. I think what we're gonna do is like set this lake up on the right side proper. Or I could just make a bridge all the way out there. That that could work too. Like, uh, well, I don't have a sledgehammer, though. That's gonna be challenging. You do have to sleep first. Smoke a cigarette and sleep. You can, like, build fences and stuff. Yep, yep. Yeah, play this game, right, Miff? Or are you just tuning in? And just checking it out. Takes a lot of time and resources. Yeah. I, I don't mind it. Uh, but I don't think my carpentry is like good enough though. So. Yeah, I play. Cool, cool. Okay, time to sleep. We're gonna sleep. And I guess we'll see what we can set up. You got too far, 
and stuff, you know? Okay, gotcha. I do have to, like, wash my clothes out. And I hope Horde Migration didn't catch up back to us. And we're almost out of uh, overweight. That's good. Fitness isn't too great. Strength isn't too great, but... Yep. If we can work on this, that would be the highlight. It's way too dark out, so I don't want to cut wood yet. We need a wood. Uh, wait, no. We, we need an axe and a saw. So we're gonna start, like, chopping stuff. We do need a pickup truck, because I, I made a whole freaking video on why pickup trucks are really good for... <laughs> for cutting down trees and stuff, yeah. Yeah, that, that fitness hurts to watch. I'm surprised I lived this long, man. Like, dude, look, look at this. I'm 28 days. My characters are nearly... Every time full point into fitness. Yeah. Dude, I'm 28 days, 381 kills, right? But yeah, I'm playing with sprinters. <laughs> I'm playing with sprinters and 28 days. It's not bad. Like, honestly. Like, I've played full strength and fitness characters and I still die sometimes. Like, th this was just a good run. Good smoke. I'm surprised to be honest, yeah. Oh, but I, I've played worse characters. Like, I, one time I was playing uh, weak, so like, two strength, and out of shape, like, uh, well, uh, zero fitness also. Wait, maybe like two fitness. Uh, and that was the old series with Ivan Keeler. What traits? Oh. What traits right now? Let me show you. Our traits right now is high thirst. Fear of blood. So you, you see like I always get anxious, right? It's cause I uh I'm always covered in blood. <laughs> cause we're using melee most of the time. Uh, we, we don't have enough aiming for shooting yet, right? Uh smoker, yeah. Cowardly short-sighted don't know what this trait is it's just empty now uh, we have speed demon dude this this is a good trait for towing but i can never reverse because it like really like it attracts the entire area when i reverse uh, my car it's like a gunshot so fast reader it's okay you know light eater great and lucky i think having lucky Helped us find a lot of cars this run. I don't know why. I don't know if it actually affects how many cars you find. But I kept finding cars with a lot of gas in them. I know a lot about traits, yeah. Resilient. Uh, honestly, like this is kind of a bad trait. It's, it takes a lot of points out of you. But, well, we have it. <laughs> uh, runner. Brawler is kind of good. Because... No, the entire reason why I have like three long blunt right now is because of this. Fast healer, I think kind of helped us when we got burnt earlier. Not sure. We did get burnt. Lucky is okay. Yeah, uh, I don't know. It might, it might just be like a gambler's fallacy thing because, uh, yeah, I just found a lot of cars with gas this run for no reason. Other than that, we have organized, which is a must. Like if you if you want to have a bag and not be over encumbered all the time, yeah, you need organized for every single run. And these these traits, holy, like out of shape and overweight. I can't believe like I, I lasted this long with sprinters that can like open doors. Right. So we gotta wait until about five. I'm gonna split. Do some little deep game. Fast healer is like one of the worst traits for me. Too many points for that. Yeah, true. You know, thing is, it's not uh, like my build isn't the optimal build. 
I'm just playing what people tell me to play, right? Because uh, that, that's just what my whole, like, you know, live stream is about. Uh, well, if you're in the Discord, you can send me a character sheet, then I can play as you if you want. Yeah. Alright, uh, maybe we should... Okay, why am I so heavy? That's the first question. It's all this stuff. And since I have electrical one... Oh, oh, right, right. If you have electrical one, you can pick up the deep fryers. Uh, so, deep fryers... Like, like, you see this thing, right? It takes a lot of electricity. Uh, well, it like... Well, if I already have this thing, I don't have to pick up the other stuff. But uh, this thing, uh, I think it takes three electrical. But a deep fryer only takes one electrical. So if I wanted uh, another like cooker thing, I could pick it up. But I don't need to since I already have this thing. Right. It's 5 a.m. Just gonna chill out. And then we're gonna set up our base. We're good on gas, food, everything else too. Why am I the only one talking? Uh, we have like a thing where sometimes people just like lurk in the background. And dude, I feel like the participants think sometimes it just like just hides some people. I'm not sure if it's a privacy setting or yeah. Like I have a like. One of our guys who subscribes to the channel, I mean, like, he actually, like, pays me kind of like the Patreon way, right? Um, like, Toridin, he, he literally just, like, sits for, like, six hours. And when I end the stream, he's just like, oh, thanks for the stream. <laughs> Lurkers, they're coming, we're done, there's no hope, exactly. So, I just assume someone's... Someone's always in the background, even even if I'm just like talking to myself. So, <laughs> run for your lives, exactly. Right, let's set the outside up. I mean, in general, if you want to stream, you should just like talk as if. At least five people are watching all the time. <laughs> I feel like, in general, that's good advice if you ever want to stream. Just assume there's a couple of lurkers, even if you're at zero viewers. It doesn't hurt. Let me... Oh, I still have water here. Let's go. If I pick up a bathtub, that could be kind of good too, because those things have like extra water capacity, so it kind of stacks on top of on top of the water barrel capacity. Okay, let's head out of here and let's check how's the outside looking. It's been a while, so I hope my instincts aren't too bad. Oh wait, wait! I need an axe. And I should wash myself off. This guy did have a baton, uh, nightstick, so let me put that inside before I head out. I'm unfortunately not gonna be here for the entire stream. Oh, that's fine, dude. But th thanks for swinging by. It's nice to see you around. I'm just gonna put this nightstick over here. Yep. We have a lot of weapons. He had a gun on him. Uh, one thing about that gun, it's using like 45 ACP, and the uh, bullets for that, it, 
they're pretty pretty heavy, so I I don't want to use it, really. Not that bad. Let's craft some sheet rope. I need a pickup truck. More to the collection, you know. Oh well, yeah, I could just put it on the top there. Doesn't hurt. Yeah. We we'll place this on the counter. Might as well. I can sew your shirt. Sure. Mm hmm. Guess I'll just stack up all the sheet rope here first until I find a pickup truck. Let me check how this car is looking like. Also, I should wash myself up because being anxious all the time, that's not too good. This car is... I mean, <laughs> my, my, my voice cracked there. But yeah, like this car is really good. I'm glad I found this. I, I don't remember where I found this thing. Okay. I'm gonna wash myself up down in the lake here. Oh, and that's my old truck that I swapped out the tires for. The police cars in the game. Yeah. Really useful. Because worst case scenario, you can always just leave this somewhere and just like make all the uh, zombies that grow there. Oh, we really cleared out this entire area, huh? Unless a helicopter or meta event happens, I don't think the zombies are really coming here. Something just drags me to them. Mm hmm Oh, wait. Why do I hear... Nah. I always feel like I hear zombies, but they're never really there. Might just be my PTSD and schizophrenia in-game. In-game, in-game. Hmm. Nothing here, nothing here. Ah, uh, that's just... Okay. <laughs> Might be. Cocaine. You ever see that one meme with Arnold Schwarzenegger? Where he's just like... <laughs> uh, he, what was he opens like a foot full of like cocaine or something. Cocaine. What is that sound? Today's probably just gonna be like a chill stream. We're just gonna work on our fitness if we can and maybe we fish here, but well, I have to set up like an enclosure so I would just get bit from the back. I saw that. Whoa. Oh, whoa. It's okay. It's not Build 42 yet. Yo, I can't wait for Build 42. You set on cement. Also, since there's so many zombies, I guess I could use my gun. How much 9 mil do I have? About 290. What's the plan today? We're gonna set up our, uh, set up our base. See, I'm excited for Build 42, mostly weapons. Oh, yeah. Oh, and hey, Ivan, let's go. So, uh, our plan today is to set up a base, maybe, maybe set up something around, like, this lake here. Like, I love this lake, and it's right next to the water. We need an enclosure here. Let's go where? Pew pew! Yo, Ivan! Yo, we got the double Ivan action, let's go. He's gonna set up a base. Why are there two zombies here? The duo, let's go. The only thing I hear whenever I start a stream is like 10,000 years later every single time. Hope you're having a good stream, yo. Well, I just started. How are you doing, dude? Just got back from my hometown. 
from the villages without internet. Build for two might have some blacksmith forging, maybe apple batch to make ammo. Typical Ivan behavior. Let's go. The only reason that we have get uh, well working power is because of this. We found this in the exact time before the power went out. Wait, let me set up our Beretta here. And maybe I'll put some of my weapons here back there. I, I don't need a meat cleaver. And maybe not a wrench too, I don't know. Making ammo IRL is easy if you know how. Well, you need like the ammo press thing for like the charge. Wait, well, not the charge, what was that? You can measure the powder grains by hand, I guess. You can. Well, you need a mold for like the brass. The tips, you need a mold also. Then what else? I guess like the. What was that? The primer? No, no, not the primer. What was that thing in the back? Yeah. But you could, like the ammo pressing. I guess you could make it by yourself. It's not gonna be hundred percent precise though. Yeah, yeah, the primer. Okay. I've seen like videos, people like just making. Bullets from scratch. <laughs> Good night. Hey, Vivi, what's up? How are you doing? Dude, earlier I was playing like Ninja Gaiden. That game was a freaking nightmare, dude. Like five hits. Like imagine a hack and slash and you just die from five hits. What the heck? Take care, baby. Just go out here. <laughs> Let's go. Okay. Wait, let me see. Do I have a saw? Okay, I have a saw. Don't have a hammer. So we just gotta pick up a hammer real quick. You die in three hits in Bloodborne. Yeah, Ninja Garden. <laughs> uh, I was playing Ninja Gaiden, Gaiden. And I was playing like hard mode. It's still not the hardest mode yet. Uh, when I was like nine, I I played like, up to like Master Ninja. I have no freaking idea how I did that when I was nine years old though. Collect casings can make gunpowder primer hardest and projectile is relatively easy. Yeah, I think the projectile you could kind of just makeshift to like any type of metal. But it's probably not going to be the right way. When we playing Elden Ring. So expensive. Ghost of Shima. Underrated, yeah. Need a lot of nails. I think we have like boxes of nails up here. But. Worst case, we can just scour around. Let's see. What do we have here? Uh, axe. Oh, we don't have a lot of hardware. Guess we're gonna look for a hammer. Wh where did I leave one? Well, there's a hardware store. L let's go real quick. Well, cans fill them with some stuff and wait down. Yeah. Okay, hardware store is up there. And I did tell you that I can't reverse, right? So. It really hurts driving and not reversing at all. Okay. Let's go. I should work on my aiming now. If I find some zombies, I should try to shoot them. I can't run Elden Ring. Liza P. Liza P. Wait, that that's not like... 
uh, FromSoft, right? But it's a game like FromSoft. Okay. Let's check the perimeter real quick before I head inside. Always smart to do that. Plank here. Bag of plaster. It's a Dark Soul kind of game. Is it like good? I might check it out. Well, I, I keep saying that I'm going to check stuff out, but you know. Eh. My brain keeps going back and forth uh, for a lot of things, so you don't know if I do. If I do play it or not, I just do whatever I want to do, really. Next Steam sale is after Elden Ring DLC releases. Let's go. I might wait then. Been hard grinding on Diablo, Diablo 2, Hardcore 1 Life. Of course, two weeks, died three times, act three out of six. Uh. Yo, I saw, well, I just bought like the Xbox Game Pass, right? So apparently you can play Diablo with xbox game pass i think i'm not sure i currently gambling oh well careful about that i've heard a lot of horror stories about gambling <laughs> who am i to say I, I feel like life is a gamble by itself i'm gonna disassemble some of this just so i get some uh, carpentry XP. Not crossplay. Looked it up. Oh, okay. What? It's not crossplay? Gamble until you only have your underwear left. Damn. That's one way to live. Let me set the carpentry XP. Just so I can see it. We're not too interested in our electrical anymore. So we can just start breaking all this stuff. What's my carpentry yet? I need it to be at least four so I can make water collectors. Steel Rising, another underrated Dark Soul game you can look up. Oh, what? Like Dark Soul type game or something made from FromSoft? Oh, that's not a lot of XP. Yeah, well, it's still ticking down. That's good. Uh, let me eat some of this. Dark Soul type game. Okay. Not sure what the game dev studio. Hmm. Hey, don't break houses. Oh, this is hardware store. Don't worry about it. Wait, uh, crowbar, eh. Oh, box of nails, we need this. Yep, gotta get a ton of that. And hand axe, yep, pick this up. Pick this up. Okay. Are we gonna work our carpentry by just cutting trees? Should I? Or should I not? I lost at gambling. Oh no. <laughs> no. Say nine to gambling. They have no money, family, friends, and 15 left to live. No. Dude, I never gamble even in like games, dude, because I'm scared I have like a... I have like an obsessive personality, so if I go down the rabbit hole too much, yeah, I might just like lose everything. The only way I gamble if... Uh, let's say I have like a... <laughs> uh, you know some games like you have like a start uh, save screen? I just save right before I gamble and just do it over and over again. That's the only way I'll gamble. 
I think I'm gonna pick up this truck. Okay. I'm gonna use my gun here. We need the sheet rope. Thank you. Oh, we, we got some... In gambling, you never win. You just gain advantage temporarily. True. Gambler's fallacy. The house always loses. <laughs> If winning constitutes losing, well, you know, house always wins because you have the bigger pot in their wallet, right? So they can have more goes and they're always like counting on you to go all in eventually. And a single time that you go all in is in their favor because they can regain their pot and you lose more. And then you try to win back what you lost and, you know. Well, uh, that, that's how gambling is, really. Uh, you got to Deerhead Lake? Oh, where's that? I, I don't think I know where that is. I think I'm gonna pick this, this car up. My uncle's friend got zapped and I won't give any context to this. What is... what you talking about? Okay. To really work on my aiming. I have like zero aiming right now, so if I can get it up to four, I can just use guns non stop. Wait, I gotta check this car out real quick. Okay. Yeah, let's leave the tire. You need to check the mechanics. I think the engine's not too good on this. But if it's for... Well, if it's just for uh, trees, this might be good. Dear head like, Oh, thanks. Uh, let me check your link out, uh, Vivi. All, I, all in context you can get is that he works at a power plant. Dear head like... Yo, that is pretty far out. Whoa, what's whoa, what's here? Oh, what was that place about, Vivi? Looks interesting, but I don't. It looks like nothing's out there. <laughs> okay. okay, we gotta hook this up and run. Cause I reversed my car. Okay, we gotta fill up all the gas in here. Then we're gonna head away. Middle of nowhere. Uh huh. You shot one of your videos there. Oh. Was it the one where we were on fire? It had cultists with a off Z mod. Ah. Oh. Authentic Z. Okay, let's fill this gas tank up for the truck. Yep, yeah, I think that's a good spot. Is this good? Yeah, it's close enough. Let's go! All filled up. Won it gambling three times in a row. Stop while you're ahead, man. I'm telling you. <laughs> Sometimes when you go on a streak, you're like, Yeah, luck's on my side. <laughs> they put even more in.
So that was like 75% of my initial stuff. Damn. Wait, I gotta fill this up too. Might as well. Dude, I'm so thankful that I found how to use generators right before the power went out. Because I wouldn't have been able to fill up all this gas. Let's go. Don't think this car has a good muffler. Uh, okay, we gotta pick up all this sheet rope down there. So let's put this all in. Sheet rope go goes in the back. You see my tutorial? Uh, like, put a lot of sheet rope in the back, then you just tie, tie up a ton of logs. Somebody is for Sims for Men. Don't know if I said it before, but it's true and everyone knows this. True. And yeah, my. Well, even my fiance used to play Zomboy. It's fun. It's Sims if you like dying. <laughs> Basically. Let me put this here. Uh, drop this somewhere. I guess I'll just drop it in the body real quick. Let me blow my nose. Okay, I'm back. Right, let's start cutting down some trees. I guess I'll pick up a wood axe, cause why not? I have a ton of axes, so this is great. <laughs> Don't know if I can place this here. Yo, I need more tables, yeah. It's a shame I broke so many. <laughs> yeah, I broke a ton of tables up there. I'm gonna put some here. Hope my luck benefits me now. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. Ugh. Never bet on your own luck. Well, that's, <laughs> that's what you do in gambling, huh? Wait, let me see. What do we need? Oh, I need to eat. I eat this. What's my weight at? It's going down slowly. Gonna submit a character sheet where your goal is to live in Deer Lake. Oh, yeah, I might do that. Next one is gonna be Haru though. I think that that build is like a girl scout or something. Okay, let's pick up some trees. I might as well like get rid of some of the greenery around here. Just so I get a better bird's eye view. Bird's eye view of the place, yeah. Let me check. Those are moids. Don't think so. Yeah, pretty clear, pretty clear around here. Uh, let me. Guess I'll just cut down some trees here. Do I have an axe on me? I am getting kind of sleepy in game though. Don't play, per, uh, play Persona. Have fun, bros. Alright, take care, baby. We turn this off. Shit. 
Should I just sleep? Why am I so tired? Might be all the layers I'm wearing. Having more layers is good, but for for, for, for protection, but not for tiredness. Because the more you uh, wear, like uh, the more layers you wear, right? The faster you get tired. Guess I'll put this. I'm gonna place this somewhere. No, I mean, just put it in a closet. What are we doing? Oh, I'm running out of water. Smoke. Gambling is a mess. I want more than I had in the start. Gambling is a mess. No comment. <laughs> well, if you're doing it for fun, yeah. One thing I don't get is... Have you seen like those, uh, what is it? Professional poker players? How do you get so con consistent with freaking gambling, dude? How do you gamble your life spent? Is that an actual thing? <laughs> there was a movie with Justin Timberlake where they had time as an actual currency on their hands, but I don't think you were talking about that. <laughs> um, oh, I have seven water bottles. Oh, we're not going to be worried about water for a while. Let me place this all down here. No, it's like an inside joke, okay. Gotcha. I think that's why we were so heavy this whole time. Just had a ton of water bottles on me. That's all. Right, let's pick up a wood axe and we'll start cutting down trees. I just say with my friends that I'm gonna die real soon and do really ridiculous stuff to survive longer like gambling. <laughs> it's a luck thing, huh? Is that, is that what you mean by that? Okay. We should probably sleep. Tomorrow, we're going to start cutting down trees. We're being so cool that the Grim Reaper gets depressed. Damn. That's one way you live. Sleep. Sleep, sleep. Wait, no. Uh, Do I have anything to read? For not being as cool as me. <laughs> yeah. 
You got the gambler is. That's why he said. Crowbar goes in the back. Yep, we're gonna be cutting down some trees and start sawing some logs after we get up. Still pretty pretty early in the day though. It was probably a mistake wearing all these layers. So I might have to cut down on some of these. I'll put this away. Good for protection, but just bad in general. Wearing too much clothes. Guess I'll rest. Sit and rest. Sit. Just fast forward the time. Kind of have to. Wait, did I block the entrance, huh? Yes, I did. We're kind of safe here. And since we don't have uh, six carpentry yet, we yeah we, we can't really make a second floor until that happens. Oh, we can, we can. We just need uh, a ladder. And that's all. We need a ladder and like a platform to stand on top. What am I? Oh, it's because of the anxious thing. Let's sleep. I hope I have a book or something. I don't like being depressed in this game. Oh, I slept a ton. I wasted an entire day. Okay, smoking. I just love mixing serious, uh, serious real stuff with really silly, goofy stuff like gambling my life, man. As long as you're not doing that, like, really, you know, it's fine. Here, let me cut down some trees. Let's get some work done. Why do I feel like there's zombies outside? You could technically gamble in your lifespan. Well, you could if you like put your organs as collateral, I guess. <laughs> That's one way. Why do needing your special cells? Like you sign a contract, like oh, I'm gambling and yeah, I uh, gotta sell my liver if I lose. That change into neurons and muscle cells. I feel like I have a sledgehammer. I have no idea where it is though. I'd be in one of the cars. Oh, there's a light switch here. What? Well, why, why did the power go out? Ah, there you go. And as you edge, you get less of them. You mean like the stem cells? Is that what you mean? No fuel? Oh uh, no. You got fuel. We cut down some trees. I think this spot 
could be good. I'm gonna circle around so I don't mess up and kill myself. Okay. I'm gonna cut down this. Okay, too long, sir. Oh, stem cells. Oh, you can? I, I didn't know you could do that. Don't they extract it from your spine or something? If we had a way to getting them to create more, we could like... Oh, what was that sound? Cure dementia. And make organs. I saw something kind of messed up where people were taking like stem cells from babies like uh, cells and stuff stay alive longer yeah world is kind of weird that's all I'll say or log stack thank you let's put this in the back Yo, Haru. Sticking out your yard for the Rizzler. Hey, yo, Haru. How goes the dragon's dogma ing? Uh, and let me know if you want Virgil to change his class or anything. Like, dude, like, you, you can tell me to do that. Because I'm not playing too much, huh? Babies have a lot of stem cells. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Let's put this in the back. Still got two logs down there. I need more sheet rope. So I guess we're going to kill some zombies. Need two log stack. Put this in back. I am thirsty. About to go biking. Nice. Man is staying healthy. Maybe I'll do some push-ups. So I feel like I'm exercising too. Oh, the engine died. Let me pick up water. Wait, no, I should sleep. Oh, not yet, not yet, not yet. Like, we could make our bodies produce more of these, but we have no idea how, and it could potentially cause deformation if unregulated. Yeah, like mutations, right? Like, uh, I could become an X Man. <laughs> not in a good way, like, one of those, like, weird X Men. Like, my superpower is having five arms. <laughs> Let's go. Let's put this here. Yeah, I'm not sleepy. I thought I was sleepy uh, earlier. Could live forever, no dementia, no aging, great regeneration. Yeah. Imagine we become like Deadpool. Like we live forever, but we're just like looking real weird. Our bodies are like regenerating so fast that it creates cancer cells. Yeah, that's gonna be freaky. 
Broken spinal cord, no problem, we back. Yeah, just like growing a tail. What's my health at? No, not my health. My weight. We're almost out of uh, overweight. Let's go. Stem cells can't do that that fast. Well, at least like slow enough. Uh, like fast enough. Like recovery time instead of like 10, 10 years. Well, not 10 years. I mean like a few months becomes like a week. It's like having a quirk. <laughs> Oh no, the Boku no Hero Academia people are gonna be like, Oh my god, I have a quirk. Am I Deku? The fandom's gonna come. Hey yo. Let's cut down this area real quick. Cut down tree. Kinda like being an, just an external fetus, yeah. It's really scary cutting down trees. Cause I, I never know if a sprinter is gonna sneak up on me. So I always just look around real quick after cutting something. So uh, Dragon's Dogma 2 is alright. I'm still in the beginning, I think. Getting sidetracked by side quests. You gotta admit, like, the... The climbing mechanic is super fun, right? You just start picking up other people's spawns, giving me 10k for Slayer Tass. Yo, yeah, that, that that's a solid way to get gold. I might play like New Game Plus. Just so I, I get I get all the quests done. There was a thing about finding a Sphinx or something, but I I, I don't know where the fuck uh, where the fuck that thing is here. Yeah. I did find it on my first playthrough, so I might do that on the second one. Don't know how I feel about Dragon's Dogma. If you're if you're hearing stuff about mon uh was it the D what was it micro microtransactions? Dude the microtransactions I never had to use it. Like I don't know what people are on about. Kinda like what people talked about DMC having microtransactions, but it's so optional that you never have to touch it. I got to the end of the game and I never had to buy anything. MTX is no issue, but performance sucks. Yeah, true. Uh, what's your GPU, Aru? If you have, uh, if you're using a a Ryzen 4000 series, you could use a frame gen mod and increase performance that way. 3070, okay. Oh, you're just one class up about, above me. I'm using a 3060. Need to lock set. Blood is packed. Hey, yo. Uh huh. RTX 3070 is suffering I'm using frame gem mod, but it still suffers from fr flickering UI. Damn. What? I, I, I'm using 3060, but I'm doing pretty fine. And I could stream at the same time. But, well, I'm playing at 1080p, so. Yeah, that, that might be it. Like, 3070 should be able to play like 4040p. But maybe you can't. 30 FPS. Oh yeah, I was playing 30 FPS. I could play 60 FPS, but then I don't want the the frame drops and crashing to happen. 
I want the 60, yeah. True. Well, it's probably going to be like a cyberpunk situation where they'll fix it eventually. So, a shooter, you can hell handle 30. But you want the pretty FPS, right? I, I know how you feel, Haru. Uh, I guess it's sleepy time. Let's turn this off. Monster Hunter had the same issues in the beginning, apparently. Because, you know, Capcom, they, they probably just, like, really prioritize their uh, console performance. And they just, like, release their ports without optimizations first. Then they think about optimizations, like, 100%. I have been playing on a PS4 for a lot of my life, so low FPS doesn't bother me that much. Oh, and how much, like, RC are you getting from using my pawn, Haru? I dislike Capcom big time. There's some good hits here and there. Like, DMC was a solid game. They really listened to their fans for that one. But yeah, Dragon's Dogma, I don't know what the heck they're on. For their PC port. Okay. Like, Dragon's Dogma 2. I think the worst issue that is a uh, problem is not even the GPU, it's just a CPU performance. Hey yo, I just got an idea, what's up? <laughs> Gonna give you something when I get home. Oh, okay. Yo, I was thinking of giving you like the end game armor, Haru, but uh, I I gotta ask you first, cause, cause if I just give it to you and you don't use it, it feels like a waste. Bye, Virgil. Okay. Oh, all this food's rotted. No, damn. I don't know what you send me. Sometimes I send you like armor. And like, uh, I did give you a staff at one point, but you didn't put it on. And I was like, bro, do you even look? <laughs> oh, it's so dark out. Oh no. I think I gave you like an ironclad staff or something. Oh, you have support on your channel? Yeah, 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 I do. Uh, you can... Or how was it called? So, if you... If you join the membership stuff, you can get, like, these emotes. I'm gonna make more, but don't really have a... Idea on what to put. I might do one with a GG or RIP or something. Gimp be like, okay, I, I did it through Gimp and it's not that bad, okay, Haru? <laughs> it's not that bad. I, I'm not even using Photoshop, yep. Guess we'll cut down these trees down to south. Because having more line of sight is always good. I'll join in like 10 hours or so. If I don't. Wake up like an empty shell of a human being. <laughs> oh no. I'm gonna set 10k rewards so I can get stuff from people. <laughs> Yo, what I did... Oh, Haru, Haru. Uh, if you have, like, a lot of gold, you should set, like, rewards for... 
you know the golden trove beetles because that increases your weight capacity it's super worth it like one for 10k gold is super worth just set it over and over again and eventually you'll have so much weight capacity you'll be like very light all the time just gotta do your slayer tasks here and there I might try a mage playthrough for Dragon Sopma. Okay, let's cut down the trees here. Looks clear, clear enough, yep. How much is my currency worth? So, one dollar is about four of mine. Which is MYR. Every every membership in Super Tank really helps because, well, you know, like, uh, I have a server to upkeep. <laughs> it, it, it really helps with just, like, keeping that up, really. Polish Zlody. Sparrow. Sparrow. That, that's all I know. But that, that's your currency, right? How do I say hello in Polish? I think it's sp Sparrow? Wait. Stravo. Stravo. Yeah. Stravo. It's not Sparrow. 4.03. Oh, okay. Uh, what's up? Not the. Wait, how do I say? Not the thing he says. How to say hello Polish? Oh, witam. What the heck? Say, chair. How? Wait, no. Which one was that? Witaj. Let me hear. Witam. Witam. <laughs> okay. We put this in here. Oh, wait. I ran out of sh uh, sheet rope. Guess we gotta kill some zombies. Witam, my friend. Just don't, just don't pronounce Tsayuk. Uh, wait, yeah, it, it sounds really hard to pronounce that thing. Because is, is it close to like a... A curse word? Is that why? Thank you for trying to save my ass. Heat rope goes in here. Oh, I have a ton of uh log stacks, huh? E is just E, okay. C Z is not C Z, it's just a different thing. Okay. I wanna learn. S is more of a shushik. Oh, it's more silent. Oh, okay. Gotcha, gotcha. C is like a... Ch. Is it like a ch? Not not a s, right? It's more of, more of a ch, maybe? It... Oh, yeah, okay. Say, fuck. I'm gonna look this up. Say, 
Uh, oh wait, Polish high. Polish high. Can't hear it. There has to be like an audio sample or something. Oh my god. Yeah, it's just not popping up. Well, the only one that pops up is Weetum. But we stop it with more power and give less power into the sea. Oh, okay. I'll look it up soon. Like, I like at least learning the greetings for different languages. Hey is hey. When you say hey that way, it reminds me of that one one song. That what was that PewDiePie was singing at one time? Hey hey Monica, hey buddy Monica. Sienna is like what's up? Oh, okay. How do you sing that one song? Oh, right. All these fences, I could just like disassemble them. Oh, zombies. Kind of clear here. I think I'll disassemble all these. Always super hard to learn because of grammar and stuff. Yeah. And you guys have like a different pronunciation for a lot of stuff. So, yeah. Complicated for me. C can be written as C I. Huh? Huh? Oh? Oh? This is 16 XP? Come on. There has to be something that gives me more XP. I feel like that just takes so long. Guess I'll cut down some trees. Um, a word. Hmm. How do I... Man, I, I just want to, like, stockpile a lot of planks, but I know that's a bad idea because I'll have, like, a lot of weight to carry around. Unless I start building up. Okay, four log stack goes in here. Is this almost full? Yep, it is. Go in there. Thank you. Really not seeing any zombies now. That is a good thing. Like, I don't want to deal with sprinters now. Like, we're finally setting up a base, so... Heck no, I don't want to fight. Unstack logs, and we're gonna stack this. This goes in here. If you know the phonetic alphabet, it would be super helpful yep 
Just so I understand the tones and stuff, right? Oh, since I'm gonna be like building next to here, I guess I could. Yeah, I could just like uh, build an enclosure here, right? This as a fishing spot or something. Yeah, I could just like cut down trees here. Well, well not cut down trees, cut planks. Uh, let's unstack all the logs. E in English can be pronounced differently. Out of spite. Hmm. Always gotta check around. It's horrifying. Okay, let's put all the sheet rope inside. But in police there are a lot of shit about rules. Oh okay. Is it like French where it's like super tonal? Because it doesn't make a sound. Okay, let's saw all these logs. That's just 4 XP per. What I don't really need like a water collector because I already have a lake, right? If I just boil the water over and over, should be fine. Z and RZ is the same but sounds slightly different. Okay. Man, I'm so paranoid. The only way to know is to remember some rules. Okay. I don't know how to speak Polish. But I think Poland is one of the hardest... Is it like one of the hardest countries to immigrate to? <laughs> Do tell me. But you guys sound really fun though. If word has like an O in it, it's changed to O instead of U. Oh, okay. Polish people are rather accepted. Oh, okay. Oh, and you sound the same. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Got you. You know, at least it's not like Cyrillic where it's super hard to even read. I can kind of like make sense of it after a while, I think. RZ and Z sound slightly different. Okay. There's a ton of, of XP. How, how many planks is this? Oh, what the heck? That's 90? Oh, we're loaded. I wish I picked up like Woodcraft VHSs. But kind of too late for that. <laughs> Don't even get me started on... DZ, DRZ, and DZ, all that, yeah, oh, what the heck, that, that, that's so many that look so, so close together. I might break some of these tall fences up. Oh, 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 oh. Haven't been here in a while. 
But yeah, I did kill a lot of zombies out here. So it should be somewhat safe. But yeah, we, we do have some lingering zombies here and there. Or for... <laughs> I'm not I don't know you're gonna try, dude. <laughs> oh my god, that's a nightmare to pronounce, huh? Well, for a foreigner like me, yeah. Kind of weird calling myself a foreigner, but I am. Yes, I am. How do I work up to like 10 carpentry if I don't have the VHSs? No, it doesn't make the DZ sound you think it does? Oh, okay. Oh. Let me look this up. You'll be surprised how it sounds. I'm just, I'm just gonna uh, put it in the. Uh... They, they don't have the audio thingy? Come on. No! A lot of Polish words, they don't give you the pronunciation for, uh, well, the sound for pronunciation. They put it in the translate thing. That's Japanese. <laughs> Polish, Polish. Polish. Oh, oh zombie. Oh! Uh, I'm getting hung up on this. Drzewnica. Drzewnica. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. No, I'm not even gonna try. Oh my god. This sounds like a nightmare. I'm trying to say it. How is that neat 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 sir? <laughs> okay. All I'll say is that that is interested interesting to pronounce. Polish tongue breakers. Oh, wow. I can't imagine, dude. Yeah, I'm gonna load some of this up into the truck. Help twisters, yeah. Got you, got you. I, I know what you mean. Yeah. Maybe I'll fast forward time two two times. Oh, oh, that's scary. Dude, fast forwarding is horrifying. Uh, I'm gonna open some of my box of nails. Yo, I just started 100% vaulting zombies, got bitten because of a bug. When I open the door to let zombie in a game, doesn't allow me to shove. Yo, the vaulting zombies are interesting, right? Jimmy? <laughs> Yo, like it really makes you freak out but after a while it's not too bad it's just you gotta really pace yourself out are you liking it so far Jim? Lemkos
Carpentry. Ah, uh -huh, okay. So I think I got to drop this on the ground to use it. Vaulting zombies is nice, but I think bug and not really playable. Yeah, uh, when you try to shove them, if they're trying to... Like, sometimes it works where you shove the zombie while it's, like, vaulting, right? But, like, in general, just try not to do that at all. Because, yeah, if you try shoving them, most of the times, they just don't... They don't get staggered at all. At least from my experience. Why can I not make it here? Maybe it just bugged with my setup. Not sure. <laughs> yeah, when I was playing Vaulting Zombies, uh, whenever I try to shove them, they just don't get shoved at all. So maybe just try avoid doing that. Yeah, they don't get staggered. Even worse, just run into you, give you scratchers. Yep. I know how you feel. Like, you think when they, they vault, you can get the perfect timing to get them to drop, right? But you're kind of just gambling because it's such a like, short time frame to do that that it's just not viable. You're better off just like uh, attacking them on ground like normal. What me? What am I building? I'm building like an enclosure, so I can start fishing. Zombie coming! Oh no! I think zombies climb walls instead. Uh, I think climbing walls is even more broken because it treats that as a player animation. So you'll have like the same issue as Superb Survivors where it's super buggy and laggy, right? Oh, where are you coming from? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ah, I almost died. I almost died. Screw it. Just wait for build 42. Yeah, maybe. Have you ever thought of playing the Leaper Zombies? <laughs> they kind of work like the Hunters from Left 4 Dead. Could be interesting, but it just sounds like... Yeah, like if you, you need the dodge roll mod for that one. Otherwise, it just feels impossible. <laughs> Have you seen the Leaper Zombies? Just look up Leaper. Uh, Jimmy. Super freaky. Carpentry wall. Yeah, let's see this. Let's go. Where's the rest of the logs? I think I might be better off if I had like a secondary bag on my left hand just for carrying logs. What do you guys think? 
Today is gonna be a slow day where I just built stuff out. Just set up my enclosure. Use rope to bundle them. Yep. I was kind of stressing out on freaking getting carpentry XP, so I I just rushed and cut them. Yep. I mean, I made a whole like <laughs> I made a whole uh, tips video on how how to do it, but right, I was just rushing for XP. I got impatient there. Yep, I should have just left them as logs. I know, I know. Oh, wooden frame. You think this is big enough? Maybe? Down the line, I could still make a second floor. Maybe just one more. see much company down here i should cut these trees down just so they don't get me by surprise right carpentry all oh, wooden frame I think I'll limit it to here. Did I run out of nails? No way. I'm gonna sleep soon though. It is nice to actually do what I love best about the game, which is building. But I should have got that one mod. What was it? The building mod? Oh, wait. Friends are home. Let me see. Hi. I'll be right back.
Okay, I'm back. This said hi to my parents because he just came back from my hometown my idea for this place is that I'm gonna have like a plot start in 1931 Polish people 68% in Poland after war this Number was 97%. We lost more than 17% of our population. Damn. A lot of people. Uh, this was contributed by USSR, which made Ukrainians, Germans leave Poland. Oh, so a lot of people were Polish? So there's like Polish German people? Polish Ukrainians? Hey Tom, what's up? How you doing? We're just making our base, finally. Let me s smoke. Let me wash myself up and go sleep. We are like the most. Doing good, how about you? I'm doing good, yeah. Had a pretty good Eid Mubarak. Huh? I'm single. A uh, homogenous country, you mean? Is that what you mean? For the most. Uh, Mitmiv's talking about uh, Poland. <laughs> homogenous country means like. Yeah, that's what you mean. Like, you know how, like, Japan has a lot of Japanese people? That's what you mean. Yeah, homogenous. Look this up. Wait, uh, homogenous. Homogenous meaning. Yeah. Hitler in USSR. Mm. What's Lewi? Lewi. What, what does that mean? I, I don't want to even pronounce it. It sounds really hard. Lewa... Lewang... Dowski. What's that? 
Oh, Polish player. Okay. Carpentry wall, wooden frame. MTV Crips. Yo, hate them. About the video, right? What was it? The, the guy sweet? <laughs> I guess if you're playing with like basic zombies, there's no real reason to use fire. But, heck. If you're playing with sprinters, sometimes it's the only like surefire way to get rid of a horde. Unless you get like five aiming, you know. For me, it's two a.m. Damn, is it a Polish walk? I think it's a Polish player. That's what they're saying. Carpentry would offer you door. Carpentry door, door frame. Let's make a door frame here. Oh, sprinters and less slow zombie probably fun and challenging. Here, you made us racist? What happened? I don't understand. More, sp more sprinter and less slow zombie probably fun and challenging. Yeah. Carpentry wall. Can't pronounce Chieni. What was that? We were never racist. We had Jews and Muslims, Ukrainians, Russian people, Tatars, everyone. And you killed. What are you on about, Mid <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about. What's happening? Oh, you vent this goalie? Polish control their border very well and protect their country very good. I wish the whole EU and America learned that. Yeah. I think the immigration crisis. What was that? What was it? Is it New York or something? I was watching this one video where they're like the homeless in. Uh, in America is getting displaced by immigrants. And at one point, they had to empty out an entire school just to house more immigrants. That was interesting. I, I don't feel any certain way about it, but... Found it... As, like, an interesting food for thought. Kind of thing. We are chill, but... Wait, the power went out? Yeah, no way. No way, Jose. I saw it, yeah. Oh, uh, that one video with the interview guy, right? What was this guy, uh, the, the guy's name? Not sure. New York becoming a third world country. Yeah, that's kind of sad. Like, they had a homeless problem, but they're more ac accommodating to, like, outside homeless people than their own. Which is weird. I don't know. Gas can, a set of gas can. Turn on. You can't, you couldn't last two hours? With what? Let me put all the gas cans in here. Mom tells I need to go to bed. Alright, take care, Mitmith. Mit. See ya. Morning. <laughs> Morning day. Week. I'm gonna eat something real soon. What do I... Let, let's not gain too much weight, so let's stick to the gummies. Farewell. We shall see you next time. Bye-bye. Eat. 
It's almost 10 p.m. now in game. I just had apple cider vinegar gummies and I don't know why like I was having like this coughing problem right when I ate them uh, the the coughs went away <laughs> let's pick up this and we'll sleep I'm so hyped for the moment that my overweight is gone just so I can like use the fences more reliably afterwards a lot of Americans are leaving the expensive states and moving towards the Midwest of Africa. Less cost of living, rents prices. A lot of Californians moving to Texas, right? Well, I don't know. I'm not American, but yeah, that's why I'm here. Sleepy time. Sleepy. Eepy time. You know, okay. Uh, let, let me give you like one of my takes. Hot take. Uh, America doesn't have a gun problem. It has a lot of like societal problems that contribute to the gun problems. Because like, I, I think like, was it Switzerland and Poland have, have guns, but they don't have a lot of gun violence. What did I do in the ninja game? Oh, I, I got to like the part where I could go into like the modern era Alaska cost of living is nuts 10 bucks for bread which I can spend less than one dollar to get a loaf of bread 10 bucks for bread what the heck don't they have like all that oil money what, what are you doing with that eight dollars for a tin can of beans bruh what the heck Also, like, I was watching some YouTubers talk about, like, life hacks for America, American food, right? And for them, $10 is cheap for food. Like, what the... Bro, that, that's expensive. Like, for me, $1 for food sounds, sounds pricey as, as heck. Because I'm, I'm, I'm pretty used to cooking for myself, right? So like if I just buy potatoes and eggs, I guess that's that's good enough of a meal for me. <laughs> potatoes, eggs and ground beef and just some spices and that's a really decent meal. What's my ID? Uh what what you mean ID? And what's up Coco 10? How'd you find the stream, but ten dollars I can get three days of food with it yeah yeah yo that that's expensive for a loaf of bread is ten dollars last can grow food it's all shipping and logistics problem oh, okay that kind of makes sense but you think like they sort of subsidize their food issues with all the gas uh what's it exports or uh, how what, what you mean by that like imports they're, they're shipping away like their gas right do i play online yeah i do i do so i have a server wait let, let me i have a dedicated server that i run uh this one is this this playthrough is solo so i have a discord server and in there i have a zomboid server that i run and yeah it's on 24 7 i'm renting it so let's say if you do watch the channel and let's say you do give a super tank or go for the membership you're helping just keep up the server but you don't have to like i'm just doing it pro bono meat rice spices cheese for a50 and 150 left for snacks yeah <laughs> like if you're into rice yeah <laughs> like honestly i think uh they they look uh what was that they explain that potatoes are so nutrient dense that if you had to base a diet around it, like you, you'll be actually better off than a lot of diets out there. You could put in some greens here and there, but you don't have to. 
10 bucks is like 8 pounds something here. That's like 16 loaf of bread I can get. Yeah. That's crazy. How much food do I have? Let me check this out. And Coco, do you play this game a lot? The ultimate budget college meat is white rice and the tuna cat. I think at one point, well, I was doing this to lose weight, but it, w it was actually super fulfilling. I was just eating potatoes and I just turned them into fries. And sometimes I'd like mix in some asparagus. It was super cheap. I was just eating potatoes for every single meal. And I was losing weight too. Crazy. What's my... Let let's carry on with the building. Yo, I should pin the Discord link thing. Pin message. Welcome. Okay. This enclosure is almost done. I still need more carpentry XP before I fill in the walls. I, I don't want it to be like super low quality walls. <laughs> I'm gonna cough real quick. There you go. Been a while. Hope y'all doing well. Hey, Fire. What's up? How are you doing? Oh, my car. Might just disassemble the tall fences. I think they give like decent XP. Potatoes have good nutritional value, but no protein or fat. So I got to add some. Yeah, I was having like a egg and potato diet for a while. Small portion of meat. You can eat it alone. Yeah, it's like a stand in for rice, really. But it's still way better than rice because you get like fiber and I think you get a ton of potassium too, right? I think I'll get rid of these walls down here. I was watching a documentary on like... Uh, well, there, there were a lot of overweight people in that show. But their diet was just cheese and fries. And one of the things that he brought up, like, the reason that they can stay alive and kind of still function is because fries, even though, like, you get rid of all the good stuff in fries, you, you still have a lot of nutritional values just with potatoes. You're Asian, dude. Asian stereotypical meal is rice. I don't like rice that much because it makes me fat. Did I leave my hammer somewhere? Can I not disassemble this? What? I, th I thought you could disassemble this thing. Oh yeah, you can. Rice noodle noodles are pretty good. I eat green pesto, bacon, onion with pasta. I've had pesto, but maybe I'm doing it wrong because it tastes way too salty for me. <laughs> the four pound and be able to eat for four meals. Pasta is gone. Uh, got green pesto, bacon, onion left for more pasta in future. <laughs> Not fat, your stomach gets pumped. Because mm -hmm. rice is gets puffed with water. I think like all the carbs without fiber just tends to bloat you. That might be it. Also, if you haven't done so yet, do leave a like on the video. Really helps out with discoverability. Mm -hmm. 
You put less green and red pesto, but too much is salty, yeah. I was trying to make sandwiches with pesto. And I think I put too thick over there. And yeah, it was super salty. Maybe I'll, I'll try like lowering it down. I still have some of that laogan ma. So might cook something with that soon. Rice puff is nice. You can, but put less. Mm -hmm. Yeah, maybe like a super thin layer, right? That's what you mean, Ivan? It just looks so good and green that I ended up like putting way too much. <laughs> you got hungry talking about food, huh? <laughs> Bread, chicken. I had a light dinner. You know what I love to do? You know those uh, king oyster mushrooms? Like the, the thick ones? L let me give a wiki video, uh, wiki page. King oyster. King oyster. <laughs> yep. This thing. Uh, Alright. Yeah. This the king oyster mushrooms like what i do like i buy like a whole kilogram of those things then i just cut them up put them into ziploc bags and then freeze it uh so i cut them into dices right so what i do i i put uh, some of them in with like ground beef and it tastes so good and it lasts forever because it's frozen Maybe like three weeks and it's still good. I know that it's a big mushroom that looks like oyster in a slice. Yeah, that's nice. I do kind of ruin the texture by freezing it. But the fact that I can just prep a ton and whenever I want to cook it, I just throw it in from the zip Ziploc bag. It's kind of a life hack if you're lazy and if you want to save up on money. It's not that expensive buying mushrooms. No doubt. Be right back. Mm -hmm. See Japanese prank TV show. Use oyster mushrooms as a disguise as a real oyster to the customer. But I need to see their reaction. <laughs> Pretty pricey. Oh, it's pricey? Damn. Also, what I... If you have like a immersion blender, what I did... Uh, to spice up eating eggs, right? I made I made my eggs a little more puffy by putting eggs in an immersion blender with enoki mushrooms. Makes it super creamy. So if you notice like some mushrooms when you put it in water, it gets like kind of slimy. And when you fry an egg with blended up enoki mushrooms, Makes it super creamy. Really good. <laughs> Should try it. Have that with Lao Ganma or something. Could be worth it. What's on here?
Welcome back. I'm a little silent because I'm sneezing in the background. I might pick up some apple cider gummies even more my comments just got censored what why that's weird <laughs> it dates a fruit dates a fruit oh what's that what's wrong with that what the heck I said I'm gonna break day. <laughs> Saw some video of some Chinese tourists being rude and saying Malaysian food is shit. And they all eat as instant noodles. I was like, really? Yeah, that doesn't make sense. Like if you Bro <laughs> uh, there is way more like interesting uh Malaysian food than instant noodles uh well noodles in general. Kind of like coconut rice, uh, what's that? They call it nasi lama. You have like all the mama food, which is like Indian food. Yeah, there's so much. Have you been here, Ivan? I'm just gonna make some makeshift walls for now and I'll upgrade it down the line. Where's the duffel bag? Okay, let's put this equipped secondary. Indianos eat stir fry and good soup, but Chinese rice and rolls, yep. Meat bone or soup? Meat bone or soup? Huh. Soup tulang. Soup tulang. Look that up. I, I think that's what you're talking about. Ivan. <laughs> Indomie, good instant noodles, yeah. Oh, come on. I have to remember to press R before I build this. Don't know how to pronounce that? Not even gonna try. Japanese, huh? Soup tulang is iconic Malaysian fish. No, no, no. Uh, yeah, dish, dish, yeah. It is, it is. <laughs> yeah. I really recommend you to try nasi lemak, though. Or rendang. Uh, yeah, try rendang. Like, if you ever had to try, like, a Malaysian dish. Rendang, nasi lemak... What else? What's really good? Lemang. Lemang. Uh, well, what's what's good Malaysian food? There, there's a ton. Uh, I think rendang is a really good one. Yeah, but though those are the bare essentials of what I would say is good Malaysian food. Does Malaysia have fish? Yeah, we do. Oh yeah, ikan bakar. Ikan bakar. It's basically like smoked fish. Fish balls? Yeah, we do. <laughs> I think Ivan might know a lot of like 
Malaysian dishes because he's Chinese. <laughs> A lot of uh, tourists who are Chinese come to Malaysia, I think. Right? No, I'm not sure. And for the record, every single dish that I talked about, I can cook myself. I'm a decent enough cook. But I will say, cooking Western food is way easier than cooking like Asian dishes because Asian dishes is a lot of eyeballing and. Uh, what else? It's not. It's a lot of eyeballing, like the ingredients. And also. Uh, it's a lot of prep compared to like make cooking a steak. Like all, all you do for a steak is just cut the steak up. Or well, if you don't cut the steak, I, I mean, get rid of the silver skin for a steak, season it, then just just fry it. That's it. Restaurant Asian dish cooking is more complex than food in the West. Yeah, true. <laughs> like a steak is super easy unless you you bother dry brining it, but like marinating in uh for Asian dishes is still more complicated, I think. Did I run out of nails? No, I did. When Western see how Chinese food takes away being done in less ten minutes, it's like kung fu. Yep. <laughs> Cooking with that wok, hey. The Asian uncles cooking in, in the kitchens, you know, super fast. Walk cooking Asian dish food. We need that walk here. Yeah, yeah, that walk here. Exactly. Come on, you're eating microwave mac and cheese. <laughs> yeah, dude. Let's unequip this. Unequip. Put this in our backpack. All right. Let's look around for what we need. Baklava. Isn't that like a dessert or something? At least microwave mac and cheese is better than mac and cheese in a can, which is nasty. True. Say what you will about American food. At least they brought us... What was it? American cheese. Which is good. Nothing hits better than processed cheese. Malaysia uh, coconut curry is nice. Oh yeah, I, I can cook that. I have a recipe. They put one potatoes in a can. Like, I could give you a recipe. Like, I have it on my phone, if you want it. I could give you a recipe for my beef rendang. But, yeah, I can't exactly tell you how to like get uh, the the amount of doneness for like the spices and stuff because that's like by experience coconut pea coconut pea chicken potato curry is best mm -hmm. i can make all of that sometimes i cheat with making rendang because cooking beef dishes takes a while because they use like the tough pieces of meat and I just don't want to spend that much time so I just 
By the way, I buy ground beef, I fry it up and make it into clumps. Just put it into like the curry and stuff. It's not gonna taste as good, but it's just cheaper and saves a lot of time. Because you know, if like you make your own meatballs, you can kind of clump meat up, right? That's what I did. The only curry I know to make is Japanese curry stock, which is possible. Uh, onion, potato, carrots, and water. Yeah, like, Japanese curry is so easy. Like, I can make it too. All, all you gotta do is just add water, really. You don't even have to add, add potatoes. Also, rice separately. Japanese curry does hit different. Especially with the sticky rice. Tastes so good. I do prefer Japanese curry over uh, Malaysia curry. But it's probably because I'm just so used to eating the curry over here. It's more soupy. Uh, I'd say... Japanese curry is more of a sauce, almost. Do I know how to cook ramen? <laughs> Just add hot water, yep. The Japanese sweet curry is odd. Oh, you don't like it? I like the spicy kind. Oh, Sprinter, hello. We have a sprinter behind us. Might as well clear it out. How many zombies are in here? To run you over. If there's not that many, I could just practice my gun skills. I never had curry, just curry flavored sauce. Huh? How? Okay, time to start shooting. People keep saying, don't use guns. Dude, I have zero aiming. And yeah, it's not that bad. Curry with chips are nice. Unless watery and microwave curries, which is nasty. Yeah, I like the really thick curries. That's why I like Japanese curry a lot. A lot. curry with fried rice is nice yeah also like curry like if you have curry then you have like chicken cutlets or uh what was that fried chicken with curry isn't bad too just dip it in the japanese curry guns are low-key good i mean even at low level just let him close to you yeah but for newer players i feel like they just panic way too much to be at point blank distance and they spam shoot and die right curry with the indian bread so good mm -hmm. in malaysia we eat that a ton we we call we call those places mama 
which is like the Indian Muslim people, and they they make some banger food, dude. If you ever come to Malaysia, you gotta try it out. Curry man, Thai green or red curry, pretty nice. Haven't read. I've never had like green curry before. How is it? Do tell me. Pray tell, pray tell. I need carpentry level 3 soon. Also, I might as well read this. Carpentry level 3. I need carpentry level 3. Carpentry level 3, where are you? Don't see anything good here only have level 4 what the heck oh yeah we found one unique to me I will have to sleep soon in game Chicken breasts or thighs? I'll always say chicken thighs. Like, chicken thighs are superior to chicken breasts all the way. And you know, you can just debone uh, chicken thighs, right? It's not that hard to debone it. And chicken thigh skin, mm hmm, chef kiss, so good. So if I ever cook curry, I always use chicken thighs. Never the breast. Cause heck no. Nah. Chicken breasts are good if you're making like a... What was that? Uh, like... Those kind of fillets, like those cutlet things, right? Where you just mash it with a hammer first. Like the meat mallet. You, uh, you mash it first, then you, well, you like butterfly it. How, how is, is, do you butterfly it first? I'm not sure. So, so you like smash it with the hammer, then you bread it, then you fry it. Yeah, it's good. But for curries and stuff, like I always try to stick to ties. It's just way easier to get right. Yeah. No reason to use breasts uh, for anything other than... What was that? Chicken chop. Yeah, chicken chop. I think breasts, uh, chicken breasts in general, are just not good unless you tenderize it like the heck. Like, <laughs> it's, it's just... It's just way too tough, too dry. Yeah, I'd rather not have it. Let me read this book real quick. It's a shame that I didn't watch... Uh, not watch, but hear more of that Life and Living show before the power went out. But well, too late to be sad about that. Dry in the middle, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's why if you make like a chicken chop, you can compensate the dryness by spreading the dryness out and just substituting a lot of moisture with the sauce. That way it's not too unbearable, right? And like the oil from the breading kind of helps cut down on the dryness. Whenever I have it, I always have a drink of me. Yep. Like when you have like just just plain chicken breast and that's it, yo, it, it tastes so bad.
if I ever have chicken breast, I'm gonna meat mallet the heck out of it before I even like touch that thing. <laughs> like even if you don't put breading on it, if you just like spread it thin enough, it, it probably won't taste as dry and it will be uh well at least be tender enough to enjoy. Yeah, sometimes inject it with sauce. One thing you gotta worry about like injecting uh, chicken breast is that you kind of spread the contamination because you're, you're injecting from outside in, right? So you're getting some of that salmonella in there. So you gotta cook it all the way through at that point. So even, even dry. <laughs> uh, let's eat. And this is a good time to start reading this book. Sit and read. Skill. Oh, right. Still need to level up. Guess I'll, I'm sleeping. Sleep. Question. Are you guys into like Japanese sword stuff? Because part of me wants to just like make a tutorial on how to like sheave your sword and spin the sword and stuff. Like if you ever do cosplay, it might be cool to do it. Katanas? Yeah. 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 Have you seen that one uh, video of me like sheaving the sword? Like, all I did was just learn it through YouTube, dude. I, I don't have, like, formal education on using swords. Do, do I have a link? I have a mini one in my hand right now. Let, let me... Wait. Add hate them. Yeah. That one. Like, I tagged you in Discord. So you should see the one I'm talking about. Like I know how to make yourself look like you know how to use a sword, even though you don't. <laughs> but I did learn how to use Chinese swords back in the day. But they're they're worlds apart. Like Chinese sword play versus like Japanese sword play. Super different. You're going now. Okay. You take care, dude. I'll be seeing you next time. Hope you have a good day. We're gonna be still building all this out. Got a lot of progress done. At least have all the frames done. Just gotta cut cut down some more trees, I think. Drink me some pop. Yeah, I've watched it. Mm hmm. Wait, let me rewatch it. Did I butcher spinning the sword? Kinda dark out. Kind, kind of freaky, kind of scary, and creepy. We still have to cut down some more trees. Let me check. What's a good spot? I think I left some trees up north, but we still have to cut down this side because not. Having line of sight here is really bad. Mine is dull. <laughs> oh, mine's just a wooden sword, dude. I do have like the sharp 
performance uh, Chinese blades, but yeah, eh. It's just a wooden sword. Uh, my Chinese swords are super light though. They make a ching, like ching sound when you uh, stop it fast enough. Wait, do I do I have an old link? Wait, let me let me let me look this up. I think I have one. Videos. Where where's my old? Yeah. This this was me when I was like super young. Stainless steel for me. Uh, I was learning wushu when I was in high school. And and that's the total extent of like my sword expertise, I guess. I I didn't learn Iaido or some Japanese uh, uh, martial art at all. The link I gave was me doing a sword form. I did do a spin for fun. I think I could still do that thing. It's not that good. Okay, let's cut all this down. Need to get it out of the way. After this one tree, I'll rest up for a bit. Sit down and rest. Maybe fast forward the time a little bit. Okay. Heading out again. Cutting down the trees. Why do I feel like I hear zombies? Way too dark out. Still gotta get this done. Ace out. Two more hours until daylight. You know, I'm thinking I could just enclose the entire lake, just have a base just <laughs> in a lake. 13 years on YouTube, yeah. I think I was on here even longer, but didn't really post coherent stuff until I did this whole zomboid thing. I was like dancing and doing like some sort stuff didn't really take it that much seriously but well here i am i'm monetized now yay Whoa -ho. <laughs> i think streaming kind of ch carried this channel a ton just meeting a lot of new people But, I guess the tutorial videos did kind of help too. I still get about like at least 40 views a day from that one carpentry video. Let's four logs stack this. Let's four logs stack this one too. Right now, three log sacks. Put this all in there. 
Also, I could make spears. Yep. I think we're in a good enough spot where we can just make a ton of spears. So all that sound. what's on here you've met your quota of 100 to thousand oh uh for live streaming or from youtube views oh so you need about okay to to get monetized right you need four thousand hours watch time and one thousand subs so most of it came from no no it's a combination like I, I guess half and half like the live streams actually gave a ton of watch time uh especially the schools out series like that thing got about like 2k views out of nowhere uh for videos i guess Maybe half, yeah. Half, half. I'd say I get about... Well, the highest watch time I got from a single video was 400. Oh no, 500. Which was the first carpentry video, the carpentry hacks video. But in general, it's just about like 100... Uh, well, maybe 200 to about 100 watch time. Yeah, the carpentry video carried a lot. But it's still just 500, right? So, like, the steady watch time I get is from all my live streams. So, like, let's say one live stream is about uh, 20 watch time, right? But since I made so many episodes, it... It carried the uh, my channel a ton. Four viewers now. Oh, okay, it's not bad. If it's like more than one viewer, which is just me, I'm I'm more than happy. Cause cause dude, think about it this way. Like when I was starting streaming, like on here, it was just me talking to to no one. <laughs> so this is still better than nothing. I'm grateful for anyone watching. Because I used to stream on Twitch, right? And Twitch, dude, I, I used to stream for seven hours straight. No viewers. Yeah, the zero ex uh, viewer experience is bad. Yep, I can relate. I've been there. I've been there. Which was rough. YouTube treats me really well. YouTube is all about making... Well, for at least for my live streams, right? Making a good thumbnail and... Title, and that kind of carries the whole content there. For videos, you gotta really plan it out. Scripts, you know, viewer retention. Here... I can just use the same thumbnail and title for a whole series and it's more chill that way. That's why I jump in anyone's stream when I see zero views. Hmm? Yeah, I try to do it. I try to do that too. Sometimes you just don't talk though. Don't know why. Like I gave a lot of streams a chance. But I don't want to be like the backseater of streams where, you know, I just go in a stream like, oh, you should talk more. <laughs> it, it could be like solid advice, but, you know, the guy might get defensive. Uh, eh. Maybe I should just like tell. Uh, uh, I'm not sure. 
I'm a little rambling today. A little rambly. Because my, my throat really doesn't let me talk for too long in a train of thought. Before it starts hurting my throat. Let's see. I think I need to get the the planks in my inventory real quick. They put the duffel bag on my second hand. Second hand. People are streaming Coachella like crazy. What? Coachella is in like the music festival? Isn't that like bannable? <laughs> One thing about like, uh, well, if you ever start making like content, right? You always have to keep in mind if you ever post content that is featuring a song from an artist or let's say like anime, anime footage and stuff, it's going to be a nightmare to deal with the corporate claims and strikes. Unless you have like a whole community set up where they just give you Patreon money. So I just stay away from anything that has content from anyone else. I feel like it's solid advice in general. Demonetize and stuff, yep. Like, some people think like, oh... Yeah, I'm getting I'm gonna get like a, a million views posting this video of uh you know so and so artists on my channel, right? You might get like a hundred K subs just posting the, that content over and over again, but you'll never get monetized because those those watch hours and views will not count. Only the subs count. Yeah, strikes. That sucks. Three strikes and your entire your entire freaking channel is gonna be gone. It's gonna be Thanos snapped from existence. Let's go. Okay, we're level four. So anything I use on my stream is either, you know, generated music, AI generated, or using like sound generators, or I just make the images myself, or I commission it. That way I never have to deal with strikes. Rockstar is gonna sue, yeah. <laughs> you know what scares me if I ever play like GTA? Like having the radio on might just like... <laughs> Demonetize your entire game. Oh, that's gonna bug me if I ever play Cyberpunk, huh? Because I really like the music from Cyberpunk. But if I have it playing in the background, I might <laughs> just get demonetized if I'm streaming it. Yeah, because... Uh... Like, the music is licensed to be in the game, but not on a stream, right? And content ID is a thing. Like, imagine, like, a, a game having a theme song that's copyrighted. <laughs> Every time a streamer tries to play the game, they get a copyright strike. I think that's a legit thing that happens, so. For sure. So make your own, yeah. Yo, oh wait, let, let me show you. Uh, hello, hope you're good. I'm here, but got to be away from the keys for a bit, so I won't chat for a bit. Just letting you know I'm watching the stream. Yeah, hey. Thanks, Mr. T. Okay, just, just so you know, right? This, uh... Let me show you this thing. The, this song that's playing in the background, that thing. No, that's, that's just AI. But I did, like... Uh, pick the what was it the key that it's in it's like D minor or something 
D minor just for like a spooky vibe. Then I had to like, you know, generate it over and over again. Most of the times like AI just has a lot of shit that it's not good. So you, you gotta like really sift through and sit through, f well, maybe like two hours generating crap until you got something that's fine. Still better than making it myself though. Okay, there you go. It's good, Loki. Thank you. And I did have to... Uh, well, sort of remaster it. Where I had to like normalize the levels, blah blah blah. I wouldn't say it's like 100% uh, real effort. But hey, I'm not stealing anyone's content. Which is good, right? Music is derivative in general but i wouldn't want to just like use someone's property 100 percent because i know ai like samples a lot of different kind of music but it's kind of just taking the musical process of taking inspiration from a lot of different songs and well that's music creation in a nutshell it's not great though it's it's okay and I do, I do like it. I'm just happy that whenever I play it, I never have to worry about a strike. <laughs> Cause dude, okay. Uh, if I was a dance YouTuber, Yo, thank God I stopped doing that because, bro, uh, like the strikes on those kind of channels, it's it's horrifying. All the claims and strikes, like you make barely any money. You might see those channels getting a lot of views, right? But yeah, they have to deal with a lot of disputes. And most of the money is just like split between the the music creator and sometimes they just claim 100% so you don't get any of the cut just some perspective shifts for you okay let me eat something real quick okay we finished the wall that's good just gotta make a door so let's get some hinges and yeah I hope I can just like close this entire spot up. That would be sick. Where, uh, you know, the entire lake is in sort of a warehouse, <laughs> like my own warehouse. But hey, like I could also just build like a door. Wait, no, no, like build a path. Let's see. Like, I build a path here, then build a small hut in the water. That's kind of safe. No, I'll do that. Don't think I have... Wait, I have enough wood, I think. I do, I do. At least we have the outer fence set up. I should put a door down, so let's pick up some hinges. Getting kind of sleepy. Uh, I am going to end the stream in about 15 minutes, so you're not going to miss out on much. Don't worry about it. If you need to sleep, go ahead, my friend. We did make a lot of progress today, and you kept me company for a while. It's nice having you tuned in. Let's see. 15, 15. Okay. Let's see. What can we make happen here? What was I trying to do? All right. Hinges, hinges. So let's look through the shops, maybe in the front. I think they had a lot of... Oh yeah, here, here, here. 
Doorknob and hinge. Goes on me, sir. Die. It's been a while since I've stayed with you like this. <laughs> yep, because I haven't been streaming much. Also, uh, yeah, working on like group projects, IRL. That took the win of my sales for a bit. But I'm just happy to stream like I usually do. It's nice. I haven't been joining much. Yep, I haven't been streaming much, <laughs> which is fine. Gonna pick up these hinges, doorknob. Meals on here. Maybe I should pick up a table. Man, I don't know. Would that be a good idea? Let's take one. Can't hurt. Let's put this in here. Watching this guy, Bergy Butt, he's a good fella. Oh, uh, is he doing Zomboid? I could check it out. I was watching Fast Break for a bit, but man, I just don't play Rust much anymore. <laughs> COD and Fortnite, okay. Ooh. Take some planks. Let's make a door. Carpentry door. Door. Wooden door. I need four planks. I don't know if I have enough. Let's put some here. Carpentry door. Wooden door. Let's go. Bro, I hate it rest after it went hard on it. <laughs> you know, one thing I'll say about streaming. I think it's... Uh, I think if you get high enough views like maybe back seating is probably not great right but especially when you're starting out like engagement is engagement dude like people backseat you and tell you you're doing stuff wrong just just roll with it <laughs> it's actually really good content being a headless chicken all you gotta do is just be bad <laughs> people watch you <laughs> Man, I'm really putting the work in for this place. I was trying to teach him because he's indeed bad. <laughs> oh, what was he doing wrong? I'm curious. Like, was he just rushing in? Was he like, you know, making bad builds? It hooks you up. Hmm? Like, if people backseat me, I'm like, oh, heck yeah. Like, I'm bad, but at least someone's watching. <laughs> Uh, this is me though. Some people don't appreciate it. I like it. Yo, what's with this li weird lip here? Oh god, that that's so painful to look at. 
placing walls wrong squares with no honeycomb oh damn yo when i was in uh well when i was playing rust uh like earlier on when i was trying to be a builder i i just been wa binge watch what evil worst non-stop and that's how i kind of got good like evil worse his builds aren't like the best but i think it's a good starting point not placing a tc oh wow <laughs> okay not placing a tc that's bad because someone if someone griefs you and it just wants to be like an asshole like they can just close your freaking door with a freaking foundation and a few walls like all you need is a triangle and two walls and you can't get out yeah that's gonna be rough carpentry wooden floor I think I'm gonna build out to the middle of the lake. That's gonna be a little safer. <laughs> MLRS striked once. He, he's not a bad shooter, right? But yeah, there, there's a lot of like game knowledge that you just get after a while. Like building, how to make bunkers and shit. I'm really into making like bunkers. I don't know if you can place... Can you place stashes under foundation cell? It would be funny to see a DSP type. How not to play Project Zomboid. Yo, I could do that. I could have made one for April Fools, but... Yeah, I, I was just not in the right mindset to do that at the moment. The aim you get from other games, wood foundations, yeah. I think like building knowledge and knowing how to raid the optimal ways to, you know, shoot your rockets and stuff. Just gotta know from experience. Wooden floor. I think what I'll do for this base is that I'll leave like a few squares just with water in the middle. Cat in a box. Let's go. I'm a dip. Now I'm tired. All right. Take care, hate them. I'll see you next time. You're adding basements in a long awaited next build of PZ. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that, dude. Because when. Okay. One thing I'm going to do for the multiplayer server, if I can make my own dungeon. Uh, well, basements, I'm going to make like freaking dungeons. Yeah. <laughs> right? Take care, hate them. See you next time. Why am I so full? Oh, because I have the freaking table on me. What the heck? Yeah. Good night. Wait. Let me give you a salute. Good night. Gotta put this table back where it belongs, which is in my base. Yep. Probably gonna stream for about four more minutes and... I'm gonna rest too. Or should I just go for a long stream? Not sure. It's because it's more of a slower paced stream. I don't mind dragging it out. What do you, what do you think? Let me put this here. And let me place this. How long are you staying, Mr. T?
one thing that I wouldn't uh, that I would like to avoid is uh, like doing all this building stuff but then doing it off screen <laughs> then at that point it's just like you know hey guys I made a lot of progress and yeah it's all done <laughs> there's nothing for a stream at that point let me, let me put this sound here they put the plant where, where do I put this plant maybe here I'm up however long okay guess I'll just carry on building for a while gonna put a table here for storage I'm not busy okay it is nice to seeing all the stuff like really form up like look at this so good like all this wasn't here i mean i prefer to have all of this upgraded into proper walls but yeah we can't we can't do it right now just gotta finish all of this down here i think i'm gonna make it expand downwards yeah yep i need i'm gonna make like an enclosure and like my goal is to be able to fish in safety so uh like we'll have water inside the base yeah you've been putting in work yeah like if i can just fish inside a building like we're 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 just set 100 percent. we don't have to worry about water we don't have to worry about uh freaking food Okay, let me pick up more for this. Yeah. We're kind of set though. Like, to be honest, like, this is as far as I've ever gotten with my Sprinter livestream runs. I've never set up a base like this, never really built. I've just made makeshift builds, uh, makeshift bases out of pre existing buildings. Let's unstack this. Maybe one. Saw it. Saw this. Yeah. And we're almost... Oh, wait. We actually exceeded our high score. Because the longest I've played with the the previous one that was the longest was low shed and lo low shed lasted about 30 days and now we're exceeding that by quite the amount let's take this all right i'm gonna build out all the floors down here make an enclosure we're kind of safe here so i don't have to worry about zombies barging in Carpentry, wooden floor. I think I'll leave like two, two like two by two plots of just just water inside here. So maybe I could start from here. This is a little ambitious, but I think it's going to be worth it in the long run. Okay, what else? How much do we have? So I have a four stack. So this is going to be water, right? Maybe water here too. I didn't sleep. <laughs> you can't sleep. 
You good? Hate them? Stall all this. You know, it does suck that we don't really have uh, an escape route, any other spot. So what I'll probably do is that once I have a second floor, I'll add like escape ropes on these sides, like maybe four sides. I'm good. Just don't know why I can't sleep. Hmm. Yeah, I do vibe with that. Sometimes you just can't seem to doze off. Yeah, I heard specific window of time. Fish catch more. Can't remember exactly when. It's like 4 p.m. to 7 p.m. One thing I'm not looking forward to is... I think snow is going to come soon. which Because it's like... Well, what's the month before December? My, my brain ain't working. So, it's going to be snow soon. So, snow period... There's way less... Uh, it's gonna be way less uh, fish, like fish abundance or fish catch sheds. So the only way you can get fish is if you have fishing nets, bait and a fishing rod. November, yeah. November is really bad for fishing. So you can't spear fish right now. Did I run out of nails? Bro, no. Okay, shit. Right, guess we're gonna have to hit up a warehouse soon. Since you guys are tuning in for a bit, uh, for a bit I guess I'll go to the Riverside warehouse. We did clear that place out. So we're gonna go on an expedition. Not gonna take my logging vehicle with me though. Cause that thing is heavy. Gotta suck up on food and we're gonna head up. See, so other than nails, what do I need? I guess Woodcraft VHS would be kinda nice. But I'm not well we'll scope out how Riverside looks. Like, if there's not that many zombies, I can just pick up some of the freaking v VHSs at the VHS store. Oh, zombie. That's scary. Uh, just a regular one, though. Not too bad. I'll try to sleep now, but alright, you take care. You covering the whole lake? Uh, not the whole lake. Just a few plots of water so we can fish inside the house. I don't want to touch the sides with wood. So the middle of the lake should be kind of safe, right? Let's put the log stack down here too. Oh, I don't think the zombie's trying to break down the door. That's good. Yeah. Oh, oh! Oh, fuck. They can open doors. Oh. Okay, I got to Can I make a lock? Bro, I forgot they can open doors. Oh god, what what's the point of making this freaking door? Hate them I get insomnia a bit sometimes. I can be drinking something with caffeine in 7 8 hours to bed. Oh damn. Yo, how... 
I think I need a padlock. If I get a padlock, maybe I can like lock this door. Cause dude, what the heck? I can't Well, do I just barricade it with a box every single time? Okay, we're gonna sleep, then we're gonna head to Riverside. I think I washed myself up, so I'll probably be anxious when I wake up. I'm gonna be ang angsty. Wash. Okay. Empty water bottles go down here. And once I finish that enclosure i'll pick up a deep fryer from one of the spiffles and we should have a sustainable way to get clean uh, clean water just from being there wait i also need to pick up a generator a good place for a generator would be the riverside storage houses so yeah next expedition is there you can get a key for a house building dismantle a door and use that as a doorknob oh yeah okay okay yeah I'll, I'll do that i'll do that uh what do i do right let's barricade this up and we're gonna sleep for the night yeah sleepy sleepy Also, you know what? I'm feeling kind of adventurous today. Let me just post this on Reddit. Who knows? I get some hits. Zomboid. Wait. I'm gonna look for the Zomboid Reddit. Project Zomboid. Create a post. Link. Title. Uh, URL. I'm just gonna post this real quick and i'm gonna head out wait gotta sleep i have to sleep modded okay apply and post right let's go i'm gonna sleep then we're gonna head to riverside Let's go. Ah, damn. Do you know if every zombie can open unlocked doors or is it random? I think all of them can. Yeah, I, I made the settings for the zombies to be able to open doors as a default. So, <laughs> yeah, can get kind of chaotic at times. Let me smoke a cigarette. We'll head out. I should pick up some food though. It's a good food item that I can pick up. You know, funny thing about this game? Well, at least about Reddit, right? Like, people keep saying, like, oh, what difficulty are you playing? Blah, 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 right? Like, they, they, a lot of people think that Apocalypse is the hardest mode that you can play. <laughs> but, it's not really the hardest mode.
Because technically, sandbox is the hardest if you just turn up the settings. Like, apocalypse is actually pretty easy. It, well, if you know how to deal with, like, walking zombies, all you need to do is just lead them away. Shamblers aren't that big of a deal if you know how to deal with the hordes. Knowing how to pick your fights, knowing when to run away, and knowing when to just lead them away. Like, you're safe 100% of the time. Right, I like your playing style with playing unforgiving settings. Oh, I mean, it's not that unforgiving. Because I, I was playing like one playthrough and I got pretty far with, with like vaulting zombies. Like when they go on the fence, they can climb. <laughs> that, that was actually unforgiving. Like this is actually pretty relaxing. But it does bump up the stakes and suspense more, so it could be more engaging for a viewing experience. Viewing experience, yeah. Oh, sprinters. Yeah. Did I pick up enough water? Oh shit, I gotta go back. I gotta head back real quick. Frickin' hell. Ah, uh, that's two. Oh, they're starting to pile up, huh? Wait. Uh, where's the sprinters? Harder mode than anyone else I've seen generally. You have Jimmy to thank for that, because he's the one who made me <laughs> uh, turn up these settings. I think, you know, you know the thing that really messes me up? Is that they can open windows. <laughs> okay. Let's use the the fences here. I think we'll be kind of safe here. Oh shit! We we got company all sides. Uh, where's my where's my gun? Can't see my gun. Oh, there you are. Quit primary. We gotta look for a small picket fence, then I'm gonna use my gun. <laughs> they can open window, next thing they can repair and drive car. <laughs> you mean like Planet of the Apes? They're learning, dude. Okay. So, one thing you could do with fences, right? I'm gonna show you. So if they climb, you have a higher chance of uh, one-shotting them. So I'll do this. Right. Wait, gotta scope out this side for a bit. Yep. Killed a few right there. Okay, climb here. There you go. Even though I have zero aiming, I'm I'm hitting them pretty reliably right now. I'm gonna reload first, so. What in the world? Still streaming? Yep, I am. You done biking, Haru? How are you doing? <laughs> Just hope there's no sprinters. Been done biking since two hours ago. Let's go. 
Yep, I'm gonna go in on an expedition to Riverside to pick up an extra generator and more boxes of nails. Boxes of nails, that's what I meant. Oh, and I need to pick up some water back at home. This is not ideal. Oh, shit. get some water and we're gonna go to Riverside oh damn <laughs> if I went to Riverside with no water dude I'd be done that, that would have been the run there because yeah well water has been shut off power shut off I need to be prepared before I take an expedition like way out there let's see Let's just leave the car running. How many days are we in? One month, four days, not bad. I'm not keen on what some other peoples do to make it harder, just increasing the zombie spawn and population. You know, zombie spawn and the population... Like, just more zombies, it's not that hard, I feel. Like, yes, there, there's more of them, right? But they all behave similarly and move at the same pace. So, if you know how to just, you know, circle around them and just not run everywhere, you're, you're safe. <laughs> you don't really have to overthink it. Yep, never-ending stream of Project Zomboid. Yep. It's the never-ending Dragon's Dogma. The never ending dogma. How much water bottles do we have? Let me put this here. And I think. Okay, two water bottles. I think that's enough. We can head up. Let's put the hinges and doorknobs here. Let's go. Off to Riverside. Do I remember the way? Let me look at my map real quick. Gas station safe house. Landmine would be fun if added in game or fun. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what? That just sounds like a nightmare. Hey, let's go. Riverside, Riverside. Wait, uh, I, I didn't look at the map. <laughs> I'm dumb. Okay, gotta go here, up here. All right, since we're just going here, we're not really going here. I could check out the VHS store in Riverside. Okay, let's go. Part of me wants to go to Louisville, but I don't really gain much from going there. Like, I have all the guns I need, right? I have all the ammo I need. Like, what, what's the point? It's like the same, but no satisfaction from seeing areas getting cleared out and made safer. Yeah. I did have to increase the respawn hours. Well, as... As in, like, make the response not that much. Because with wandering zombies, it gets way too overwhelming. Because these guys migrate like crazy. 
with wandering zombies. I love the mod, but <laughs> bro, the fact that they just never stay in place, right? So, yeah, places that get cleared out just get filled in super fast. I think I'm headed the right way. Maybe. But they should have respawned by now. Oh, that's a duck. Don't wreck the car. Yep. I'll try not to. This car has a good engine. Oh, Sprinter. Sprinter there. Oh, shit. Okay. Yeah. I'll try not to run over them unless I have to. And also, Speed Demon is making me drive way too fast. I gotta keep that in mind. I gotta be conservative about my speed. Am I going the right way? Let me check. Yep, I am. I'm just gonna go straight here. Oh, whoa, whoa. Yep. This car turns really slow. That isn't too good. Should have packed a gas can for the road, but we're not really lingering around here too long, so it should be fine. Oh shit. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I I turned the wrong way. <laughs> oh no. Oh no my. Oh. Uh. Okay. <laughs> Sometimes they just brain dead and <laughs> you just turn the wrong way, dude. At least I know how to hotwire, so let's say this car actually breaks down and I can still swap. Oh my god, the sprinters. What's up, Al Capone? Hey, yo. How are you doing, dude? I was out of town for a bit. I'm sorry, my replies can be slow. I have to use on screen with mouse. Wireless one battery died. Oh, that's fine. Yeah, just take your time. Like, no, no pressure to reply quick. Your brother just downloaded Zomboy, just got it for him. Yo, you should try the multiplayer server out. Yep, we, we do have 1% sprinters, but multi-hit is on, so it's a little easier. Unlike my solo playthrough where I don't have multi-hit, it's a little easier on there, I think. I have 5% sprinters here. I think zombies can open doors in the server that I'm hosting, though. So you gotta keep that in mind. Let's see. Am I going the right way? Yep, I am. Oh, Sprinter. So, first things first, we need a box of nails, right? Then we need, uh, what's that? I mean, VHS is, would be ideal, so I don't have to grab my carpentry up. I, I do want to get level 6 carpentry ASAP. Oh, oh. Okay. Where am I? Oh, we're at the storage units. Let's see. I want to see how the population here is looking like. I prefer not to wreck this car. 
But yeah, there's there's sprinters in tow. I could just get them to follow me away from here. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, but the car hood is not looking good. So I would not want to bang this car up too much. Getting a little hungry. A little hungry. This truck looks good. Uh, warehouse should be down there. Let's take the long way around and go from the back. Ah, uh, they, they might have respawned a ton here. Oh god, yeah, they're all here. Not too many though. This is kind of manageable. Oh, but... Oh, oh, yeah, they're, they're all back here. Let me lead them away, yeah. I, I don't have to fight them. Gonna lead them, like, up. I could just run over the sprinters, if it's not too many. They respawn in the buildings, huh? Because I did clear this place out. Now they're all here. Oh no. Uh, yep, that is a ton. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, first things first, we have to run over what few sprinters there are. Oh, gotta avoid the front of the car as much as possible. Okay, that guy's dead. Good. Got a few more here. I should have brought a Molotov, huh? Like I said, perfect. I'm gonna try to lead them up. Okay, that's good. We're heading down here. Okay. Okay, now if I go here should be somewhat safer. Yeah. Yeah. Looking way more clear this way. Oh, there's still one there. Uh... How do I run him over without using the front of the car? Without reversing. Oh, uh, I just reversed. Oh, I'm panicking. Okay. Yep, they're coming here. I just have to make sure they're not sprinters. Okay, how about this? I open the window and just shoot. Oh, dude, the accuracy is so bad. I forgot I have zero aiming. Yep. 
Yep. Things are kind of going downhill right now. But, hey, it's not the end of the world. Just gotta close my window up. Okay, that guy is done with. If I can bait them into the window up here. Let me see. Is a back clear? Yes, it is. Okay. If I lure them to the window. Is there an open window? Yes, there is. Just hope there's no zombies inside. I think they saw me going in. Yeah, come, come, come. Uh, not sure how I feel about this. I am overweight and I have low fitness. I mean, technically I should rest here. Am I a master at beating zombies? I, I know what you did there. <laughs> yes, I am quite the master of beating. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay. Come here. I hope they see me in the window here. Uh, a fellow <laughs> I'm not gonna say it <laughs> bro where are they okay you know what I'll, I'll just head in no no before that I gotta rest on this bench can I not rest on it don't think so I need box of nails, box of nails, box of nails. Oh, why are there zombies inside? I swear I cleared this place out. Okay, there's a zombie outside. Interesting. Rest on the plastic chair. Yeah, I could. I'd pick this up. Oh. I think we got company down there. Feels like I saw a zombie. Box of nails. Box of nails. Please, I'm panicking. Yeah, no, no nails. Not seeing any nails. Wood glue is good. Padlock. I think, can you put a padlock for, uh, like doors? Does that work? Not sure if it works that way, but worth a try. Pan X, good find.
Box vinyls, let's go. How many boxes do we need? As many as we can get, right? Check down here. Nothing... Nothing great here. Let's see here. So many crowbars, so... Oh, box of nails. Let's go. Okay. I think that's all we need. Like, we don't need that much, right? Oh, how many? Seven. Seven hundred. So we have seven hundred nails. Is that enough? What do you guys think? Hmm. Let's see. Chainsaw? Oh, chainsaw could be good. But it's too heavy. No, I'm not gonna pick that up. And I think it makes a ton of noise. Okay. I'm gonna head out of here. We got all the nails we need. It's getting kind of dark out though. You got distracted by the police car. It's kind of neat. Where's that guy going? Okay. Time to pick up the extra generator. Then we'll check out the VHS store if we can. Gotta reload. Let's see. Oh! Sprinter. We have a Sprinter. What the heck? He's dead? Quite the number of zombies here. Let me check inside. them outside if there's no sprinters i could just like get them to walk away one smart thing i could do is just jump a fence how much does this game cost how much does it cost? Let me look it up real quick for you. Zomboid Steam. Cost. So, it's about... Like, $15? Agent 47, Mr. Hitman? It's worth it. Like, I, I have like 3k hours in this game and I've... Still not bored. 
do need some different games once in a while, but I still come back to this. Yeah, 15. Really decent. Really good. And I played 3k. 3k hours. <laughs> if that ain't worth it, I don't know what to tell you. Think we're gonna do the old switcheroo in the woods. Just lead them away. So I don't have to deal with them. Okay. This is kind of clear. Wait, I do need them to aggro on me. This might be a little risky. We'll see how this goes. Okay. Right click, walk to. And I'll walk right back in. Is it scary? That ain't a sprinter though, so we're kind of good. Ah, uh, the engine's still running, so they're doubling back there. Get out! Okay. Are they all coming back? I'm not sure. I think I lost sight of most of them. Eh. We'll find out. I, I still need a generator though. Let's take the risk. I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit. I do have to look for any of these that have a generator. Oh, you're kind of piling up. You know what? I'll just kill him. This is a good spot to be in. I'll start killing from here. Okay. We're good. Just gotta clear out this path. And we should be free to pick up a generator. And we'll be right back at home. Not sure about checking out Riverside though. Because that might be super risky. With the engine we're having right now.
Move generator right here. generator oh we got one here perfect okay all I need to do now is get the car close enough there pick it up and we're good What the heck? Oh yeah, I can't shoot the guy. Because he's crawling. Okay, I'm gonna take this. Take. Put it in the car seat. Ah, let's go. Oh. Should I just sleep here? I could. Maybe on the back side. Because I don't think there are zombies on there. Yeah. Here should be fine. I'll sleep. mac and cheese okay let's eat all these sunflower seeds take a cigarette let's check the vhs store then i'll be back at home oh don't starve yeah try not to one day for one month, four days, and 21 hours. 420? Let's go. 420 kills. Take a cigarette. Smoke. Okay. Then we're out of here. Yo, we're doing really good. Cigarette done. I think I have too much here. Gotta change the water bottle out. Oh, stop raining. Let's go. Water bottle goes here. Let's eat half this mac and cheese. What's my weight at? Did I get rid of... Yes! Oh, yes. We're not overweight anymore. Good job. Yep. I won't be tripping on fences, 100%. And I won't be... Getting super... Tired. So, this is ideal. Let's see. Can we get out of here? Check the VHS store. If it's too many zombies, to just run out. Should be the warehouse. Not going here anymore. Let's check the map real quick. Quite a ways from Riverside, but we'll get there.
Oh, 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 chill, 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 chill. You know, one thing I miss about Twitch, like everything else is kind of bad, right? But they had really good like chat integration where I could display the chat for the stream. But here, I'm not sure how to do it the same way. Kind of makes me want to get Streamlabs, but eh. Streamlabs can be kind of mid. Oh, wow. That's a ton. Yo, I swear I cleared these these guys out but well it's been like a month so yeah they, they should have respawned by then okay let's see vhs store where are you maybe the let me check the map 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 okay vhs store down there so it's gonna head straight. Heading straight. Is this a right way? I think it is. Map. Just a little bit more. Yep, should be on the other side here. Let's see. If a zombie pop isn't too crazy, I could just head straight in. But I don't know. This looks a little crazy. Can I take him on? Ah. I could use the fences. No splitters so far. I could just lead them away from here. But every single time I try to lead them away, <laughs> I end up attracting more. So I don't know, man. Fuck. Ah. Okay. Let's punch him up. Oh, sprinter. Okay. Every time I see a sprinter, gotta run him over. Two dead. Perfect. Is this worth it? If my engine goes orange, I'm, I'm bailing out of here. Oh! Got him. What? Let's let's lead them away. Yeah, would be way safer that way. Just gonna lead them up north, like northwest of here. Gotta get them, get them all though. If I'm gonna do that. Making my way downtown. Walking fast. Treating the respect and I'm homebound. Why are these guys not aggroing? Now go north. I should have all of them on me. Yo, what was this? Some of the strays just keep going random. 
Random directions. Really responsive of homebound. Do 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 do. And I need you. And I miss you. And now I wonder into the sky. Okay, that song's stuck in my head now. Why do I do this to myself? Okay, let's go. I think this is enough. I'll pull them here, right? They're mostly away from that store. Now I'll go south. I'll, I'll go a big round down there. Ah, oh, shit. There's a sprinter. Okay, now down here should be a little safer. Scope it out. Okay, I do have to take care of the ones coming here. Reload. Okay. I'm really taking my time here. Okay, this window is open. That's good. Come on! Come on! Why? Why? I just needed to go to one store. Just one store, dude. Get the heck out of there. Get away from my store. <laughs> Why? <sighs> I... <laughs> Do we just abandon the mission? I, I think we have to. Dude, that sucks so bad. Like, everything was fine. Like, we, we could have... Actually hit up the VHS store there, but... Yep. If the alarm went off, yeah. All bets are off. We gotta head back. Bro, that's so rough. I don't want to grind carpentry. I'm so mad. I'm so mad. If I hit up the twiggies, I guess I could just burn them. Just take the fire approach again. But man, that's so boring. Look at all of them, they're, they're running to the alarm. Ah, you know what, uh, let's head back. We, we can, we can just grind out carpentry the slow way. I don't want to get ninja killed. If, if it'll, if an alarm went off, it means there's at least 10 sprinters at that one spot. And I won't be able to deal with it with this kind of engine. So we just gotta head back. This sucks, but... It is 
What? Oh, no. It is what it is. We do have to swap out cars soon. Well, we still picked up uh, a generator, right? We also got tons of box of nails. A ton of them. And we can build out that lake. We should be good. And I need you. And I miss you. And now I wonder. Okay, let's check. We're pretty far from home. Not too bad, though. What the heck? Where'd that guy come from? Oh, he he was a fake dead corpse, I think. <laughs> Gotta head down here, right? Yep, head straight, then head left. So many. Oh, I hope the bridge isn't overrun. That could spell the end of me. Yeah, this car doesn't deal with sharp turns really well. Uh -oh. We're in a rush to head back. getting careless but dude i just want to head back super bad oh no oh engine's dying okay we gotta bail out of this car ASAP once we get back home. This car is gonna get us killed sooner or later. Oh, oh no. How close am I? I feel like I'm close. Okay, let's check the map real quick. Okay. One turn, two turns, that should be it. Almost back at Ekron, thankfully. Let me 
me check. Map. Nope, just gotta head straight. I'm dying out here. I'm dying out here. Ah. Uh, <laughs> okay, final turn. Then we're almost back. Deja vu, I have been in this place before. Why am I driving like this? This should be the gas station, right? Wait, no, it ain't. Okay, we're back at home. Finally. Right. We just gotta plop down a generator right on the end here. It's gotta be on the outside. Let's take this. I think this is a good spot. There you go. I think it's close enough, right? For power. Maybe just one one block closer. Here. Oh wait, I didn't connect it. Connect. Wait, so I think a generator, generator, right? It does 20 blocks out. So this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. That should be fine. Let me look it up. Generator is on board. Generator is on board. Okay, so looking at it, it says, yeah, on the XY plane, it does 20 blocks out. So if I do a house on a lake here, it should be good. And there's a zombie. Let me smoke a cigarette real quick. Not ready. Oh, yeah, my car is pretty banged up. Ah, let's go. Bring. <laughs> that's one way to take care of business can I add a padlock what am I doing I did pick up a padlock right so maybe if I put it in my main inventory nah Ok, 
Can you not use these things? Ah. Man, that sucks. So I need to find... <sighs> Bro, that sucks. The fact that they can just open doors... Uh, that means I have to kill zombies in a house until they drop the key. Then I can make a freaking door that has the right key for that door. And that has to be every single time they break the freaking door down. Oh my god, that's rough. It's all this. Oh wait, I'm wasting XP. Right. So first things first, let's read Carpentry Level 3. Then sleep for the day. I'm so glad I have an actual safe house now. But that lake house is still in the works. It's gonna be super worth it though. Let's place all this down. Get all boarded up. We should be good. What's my me aiming at? <laughs> aiming almost level one. So maybe at level two. The gun will be more accurate. I would not want to use a shotgun yet, cause, bro, dealing with sprinters with, even for a shotgun is it's not great. Let me eat this. What's my weight at? Finally got rid of overweight. So that's good. Okay. Let's read a book. Is the power out? Oh shit, it is. I think the gas ran out. Let me fix that real quick. Gas can grab sheet rope goes in the truck. Sheet rope, uh, yep. Generator info, yep. It's out of fuel. Let's see, okay. Turn this on. Perfect. I have to fill this up. Fill, take fuel. Fill up all these gas cans. Oh, Riverside was rough. I cleared out the entire area. But then, the one store I wanted to check out had an alarm. Come on. Place this here. Place this here. Yep. The fuel pump need electrical to pump fuel? Yep. And that that does make sense, because pumps, you know, they need like pressure, blah blah blah. So you do have to power it up. Yep. Let me port this up, read carpentry level two. And that should be the next day. We should have enough to start... Uh, finishing that house that I made. In the water. 
we just have to cut down some trees and we're good sleep sleepy time sleep sleep Oh yeah, my guy has fear of blood. That's not good. Don't forget, close our curtain and windows just in case. I don't think they can see up the second floor. Correct me if I'm wrong. Yo, I'd love to have a balcony. That way I don't get super depressed every single time I read a book. It's so dumb. Carpentry, level three. Let's read this. Fast forward. After I finish reading, I'm gonna sleep again. Yo, this takes so long. Even though I have fast reader, it takes forever, dude. Good, perfect. Place this here. Let's sleep. Sleep, then I'll drink. Drink and eat food, smoke a cigarette. You should be fine. Perfect. Water bottle. Guess next thing on priority is to pick up a deep fryer so I can actually cook outside there out in the lake so i can make uh what's that water make clean water just from boiling looking forward to that smoke a cigarette i'm running out of matches and lighters Start cutting down trees. Quit primary. Okay. First place I have to cut down is this side. Because... Oh, I did. I did cut down the trees. Okay, that's good. Oh, wait. Maybe here. Yeah. Any place that obstructs line of sight should be gone. Cut down tree. Don't see any zombies. able to make any fish trap i think i need twine for that right well what do i need wire wire um i haven't made fish traps before might be worth it to just make it while i'm doing all this right oh don't don't do that i, I gotta stack the logs take my own advice Stack log or log stack. Go in here. Okay. Take this. Put this here. One, two, buckle my shoe. Or log stack. Put this in here. Okay, we have 
That, that's a lot of wood. Yeah. We could make out the foundation by now. Okay. Should I just get rid of the door? <laughs> uh, that might be viable, honestly. Okay, uh, wait, forgot to pick up the lock stacks. Here you go. Let's take all of them. And stack these logs. And saw. Maybe I should put some windows around, just so I can see if there's zombies outside. Why is my health looking like this? Also, I should open some of the nails. That is a ton of planks. Let's open all this. Okay. Alright. We're good. Let's start making some progress. Carpentry, wooden floor. Let's equip this on our secondary so we can carry more planks. Put more here. I think it's a pretty good looking base. Uh, well, if I actually finish this. <laughs> it's not done yet. We'll see. Carpentry, wooden floor. I do need a place to play uh, to put a staircase, so maybe this area will be a staircase. You know what? I don't really need like two fishing plots, maybe just one. This could be good enough. Okay. 
Okay. I don't want to make a straight box because that is a little ugly. So I think I make it a little staggered here. Okay. Looking good, yeah. Still need to figure out how to find a door with an actual lock. So I might have to lure some zombies into some houses for that. That does suck, but no way around it. Unless I just make sheet ropes as the only entrance point. But that's kind of scuff. I think I can disassemble. Yeah, I can disassemble my own walls. Hmm. To make this place interesting, maybe I'll make like a patio area just so I can fish and read books outside too. Here I could set up a farm, maybe. There's a tree by tree plot I could set up here. One, two, wait no. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. So maybe like double layers of plants there. Looks perfect. Wait, no. Uh, here, no. I hope I can get level 6 carpentry soon. Because that would be sweet. Like, having a second floor would be a game changer. But damn, dude, the freaking car alarm really set us back. Well, not car alarm, house alarm. For the Riverside VHS store. Just had to bail, really. I mean, I could go March Ridge. For the VHS store, but you know how that goes. Like, that place is just infested. Is this big enough? Maybe. I'm not sure. Cooking area. I'm just eyeballing it at the moment. Okay, let's take this. But for now, we don't really have to build every single piece of furniture. We could just take it from some of the houses down there. All I have to do is just set up the general layout of this entire place. Is that a cow sound? Okay. 
All right, this is the general living area. I could put some seats here. Patio is probably a two by six down here. Carpentry, wooden floor. Yeah. Okay. I guess that's the uh, general layout. And if I wanted to make a balcony. I guess this would be a good spot. Like extend outwards here. You don't have to fill up the entire lake. Oh, we're running out of wood though. Damn. As a safety measure, I should make this a double... A double layer crossway. Uh was it pathway just so you know when zombies funnel down here in the case that they do it's not gonna be a straight path carpentry wooden floor now we just need the wood for the walls and we should be good Do I have enough planks? I think I do. Oh, wrong, 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 wrong. <laughs> Never thought I'd actually build a place <laughs> in a uh, sprinter playthrough, but here we are. Looking good. All right, uh, let's take the sheet rope, put it in the car. I do have to sit down for a bit. Okay, I'm getting thirsty. And hungry. Let me sit down here real quick. Sit on ground. We're good. Let's go. Why am I so heavy? It's probably all this sheet rope and nails. Sheet rope. Ah, let's just run to the car. Put all this in here. Right, we're good. We're still kind of hungry though. Craft sheet rope, all this. Let me head up to main base, get some food. Then we'll cut down more trees, set up the entire perimeter. Why this? Why is this not on my holster? That is dumb. Yeah. 
you saw it here kids and guys and boys and men <laughs> uh you don't need that high aiming to use a gun you just gotta be point blank and have super high risk but if you're fine of that it's actually worth it using a gun takes a couple of shots so why agent 47 in my chat I'm attracting all the hitmen. Why not? Are they hitting on me? Ayo. Hey, I'm gonna sleep. Unequip. Put this in my backpack. Oh, no wonder I was so... So heavy. Because I was carrying a plank around in the freaking duffel bag. Let's open some of these and eat. Open. We're good on supplies. At least for a while. Guess I can sleep. Wait, it might be too early to sleep. Do I just cut down some trees first? Maybe. Yeah. We're not going for a big fight, so we're not too worried about being drowsy. Yeah, what's a good place to cut down? Maybe up north? North is all cut down. This side could be good. It's not dense enough though. Oh, here. Looks kind of risky though. I don't know. You know what? Yeah, the, these pile of trees, I'm going to go for this. Cutting down. Let's go. Cut down, cut down. Dude, that cow sound. What the heck? I'm gonna pick up these few logs, put them in a bunch there so I can just tie them all up. Okay. About oh, two log stacks there. stack thank you oh what oh. or long stack okay perfect put this all in did my engine just die So it did. <laughs> oh, that's scary. But well, th this isn't a traversal vehicle. It's more of a logging vehicle. That's not the worst. It's all good. It's all good. Okay, I'm gonna park this in the middle here. Yep. Good spot. 
Heading this down. And the next side. My character needs sleep. True. Wait, I'll take care of these two more logs. Uh, and I'll sleep. Didn't want to sleep too early though. Cut down tree. stack this goes in here okay so four times three is about wait no so that's about 12 12 logs 12 wait no no, no. four times four that's about 16 logs 16 logs times three what's 16 times three 16 that's 32, 32 plus 12. 44, about 44 logs, maybe. It's not, I can just sleep here. This is fine. No, to be on a safe side, let's do the car trick. Yep. Yepers. Sleep, sleep. sleep. Wait, it's on the left side. What am I doing? That's the right side. <laughs> That's fine. This place is clear as it can get. Okay. Duffel bag. Whip secondary. Let's take all these logs. One, two, take the rest. If a sprinter bites me right now, dude, I'd be so mad. Would be kind of my fault carrying these many logs. Let's set up the freaking house. Let's stack all. So, wait, no? Wait, I had more. Is that it? Oh yeah, it's in my inventory. So all, yeah, sixteen. Sixteen times three. What's sixteen times three? My brain ain't working. Thirty-two plus twelve. About forty-four. No, it's even more. What's wrong with my math? Oh no. <laughs> well, more is always good. That's fine. 48. Okay, let's take the rest of these. Put this all in here. Yeah, it's looking so... Oh, 
there's a zombie. Not good, not good, friend. Very not good. Is he heading here? Yo, if he's a sprinter, I'm freaking dead. No, he's he's going down. We're fine. We're good. We're good. It is nice that I can see everywhere around me. After I cut all those trees down. Let's take the rest here. Carpentry wall. Wall frame. I do need a couple of windows. Not sure where. Maybe. Maybe here. Here and here. Nope. Man, I don't know where to put the windows. Maybe front here. Window here. Maybe here, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Got it. Getting a ton of XP though. That's good. Patio will be down here. I am kind of vulnerable being out here because you can just open the door. <laughs> Uh, until I find a lock, yeah, this is a major, m major vulnerability. Until I get that addressed. This place is really forming up. Yeah. Oh. How many days are we in? One month, six days? Not bad. Okay, next window should be here. You know what? I'll make a separate pier here. Like a little pathway where I can just like fish also. Oh wait, I just messed it up. Disassemble. Oh, wrong one. Disassemble. Disassemble this. Wait, I can't disassemble it. Yo, that's dumb. I can't disassemble this? Bro. Well guess we got to expand one more square out uh that sucks uh, eh what do i do you know what wait no 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 I, I know i know i know so the patio will have like two walls like covering it that's fine carpentry wall To that, perfect.
I am the carpentry guy. So if I botch this, maybe you guys should not listen to me. <laughs> okay. Where, where's my bag? Where's my duffel bag? Did, did I drop it somewhere? I swear it was with me. Oh, because I saw this sod. Sued. Sawed the logs. Make me drop it. Okay, let's take this. Might not have enough wood, so we'll have to cut again. Carpentry wall, wall frame. Can I make the wall level two yet? Wall. Not sure. Okay. Window has to be here. No, no, maybe in the middle here. No, no, here, here. here. Thanks, take more. It's really coming to fruition right now. Carpentry, wall, wooden, yep. Do I need a window here too? Maybe... Maybe like this side. Like this here. We're gonna do a single door though. Not a double door. Okay. We need more planks. Oh, damn. Smoking. Smoking. Gonna eat some butter. <laughs> eat some literal butter. Okay, where do we cut trees? Go look for somewhere that's dense enough. Sheet rope. Oh, sheet rope goes in the back. Thank you. Hammer goes on my belt. Saw goes on my belt. I don't think you can put a saw on your belt. Butter here. Lighter here. Perfect. Okay. Let's scout the place out for somewhere with a lot of trees. Let me check the map. Dense forest is up north. Equip. Where's my axe? Equipable. 
elephants. Don't see those tall evergreens. Not sure where we're supposed to find them. Because those things hold a lot of logs when you cut them just once. Oh, zombie. Don't want to deal with it. I'm just out here for trees, dude. Leave me alone. Yeah, I'm in the middle of nowhere. Let's just look for a simple place. Oh, like here. Yeah. In the engine died. Maybe this one? This looks kind of dense. Or here. Yeah, 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 this works, this works. Check the perimeter. Cut down. That's four. No zombies. Inside, I don't see any rustling. So, oh, one's coming. He hears me. Thank God it's not a sprinter. Got him. I gotta switch out this axe soon. I think I have wood glue though. Yeah, there you go. Repaired. Might have to sit in the car for a bit because we are tired. Can you guys hear my cat in the background? Don't think so. Okay. Where do I park the car? I think somewhere here. Make a four log stack. Wait, what? It's not close enough. There you go. It's taking so long to load up. Oh, it's because of this. I need a smoke. On one hand, I don't want to attract too much attention. On the other hand, reversing is just way too convenient. 
Four log six. Whoa, whoa. What the f That was a jump scare. Two log stacks, perfect. Take the way around. This is a ton of progress. Okay, put this in. Sleep. stack the same oh and more sheet rope because it is a zombie thank you uh, sheet rope what should I have about 18 more I guess I could just keep cutting trees until I run out of log log Lock stacks, lock thingies. Where am I? Pretty far out. That's almost scary. How far we are from home. Let's not be too far. That's a zombie. Okay. We need more trees. Let's cut... You know what? This location looks kind of promising. I have to scope out the surroundings first in my car. Just in case. You never know. Yep, looks kind of clear. Okay. Cut down. Let's go, maintenance. What's my maintenance at? Level 2? Not bad. That's a ton of logs. I think I'm getting greedy. Okay, I'm gonna run to the car real quick. I don't like being tired. Cut down more. OK. 
case. Perfect. Make four log stacks. Two, three. Should be four. Let's get these ones up here. Two tree lock stacks. Okay, all that's left is these two. One, two. Did you know in Project Zomboy? Stacking logs makes it we lighter. Don't know who the hell made a tips video about that, huh? Four log stack. Does this decrease my speed? Oh yeah, it does. Okay, so being heavy is not good. Put this away. Okay, perfect. Now I just gotta load it up. That's a little too far. Put it here. That's a ton of logs. down here take more oh it's full do I just take it with me <laughs> you know what let's just do that Okay. Driving straight out there. Just gonna drop all these log stacks. We should be good. <sighs> Zombie. Let's gotta drop this real quick. I need more. Man, it's looking great. Who knew I'd actually build a base from scratch? From scratch, too. Yeah, quite an achievement. I meh. Yep. What? I get bragging rights for that. Why not? I know that feeling. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Thornton, you are you are the builder. Yeah, making some real good progress here, man. Making you proud. I'm trying to. This full looking good yep yeah oh 
Oh, what, what do you need my help with? What's up? Wait, uh, okay. I've been stopped by for all. Yeah. Oh, my, my parents need my help real quick now. You saw the photos on Discord? Yeah. Did miss your chats for a while. But, yep, gotta help out. I will, maybe like five minutes, I'll be right be back. Let me take you to the standby screen. Okay, I'm back. Yeah, gotta spam the cat emojis. Let's go. Let's go. Yo, this is the longest living character I've had so far. Let me show you. Info? one month seven days even though like i had overweight and out of shape how the heck did i live this long dude i don't know we actually got hot hot wiring done we actually got a base almost done we hooked up a generator we have all the manuals we need yeah well only thing we were really working on is carpentry then we should be good Let's place this down here. Place all. I think I'm gonna make a cat emoji with GG and RIP. Only thing left to do is now die. No, no, Jimmy. A building will level that up. Yeah, I'm trying to. Let's see. Never thought I'd actually like get around to building in a sprinter playthrough. <laughs> Cause all I've done is just barricade like the front with a few boxes here and there. Okay, let's take a log stack. And unstack one. Saw this. Saw all. If you notice, I put a generator right outside here. <laughs> and dude, Jimmy, like building a base is so scuff. Because even if I make a door, I can't lock it. <laughs> So I have to look for a doorknob, which I have the key for. So it is <laughs> so dumb. Unless I just like not have a door. 
<laughs> I just have sheet rope. Can't build a staircase yet though. That sucks. That or get door lock spot. Oh, I might do that. Yeah, it's dumb that you can't make a simple lock. Like, you could make a lock out of wood. Isn't uh, the door made with a poem? What's a poem? Eh? What's that? Why am I so heavy? Oh, yeah, because it's all on me. That is doom. the thing yeah it's it's made out of a doorknob and a hinge right but since i didn't have the key for it i can't lock it yep so the only way to do that is to find a house kill a ton of zombies until i find a key then get the doorknob it, it's so dumb but yeah it's just how it is unless i get the doorknob Door, door locks mod, which Jimmy told me about. Since zombies can open doors in my playthrough, just having a door is not good enough. They can just open. <laughs> it's so dumb. Uh, yep. Even if I put a window, they can just open the window. Okay. Carpentry, wall, wooden frame. Here we go. And gonna do a door frame. And level up door. I don't think it matters what level it is. It just matters if it has a doorknob or not. Well, uh, if I have the key to the doorknob. Carpentry. So I have to get rid of this door eventually. It's, it's just there for a placeholder at the moment. Uh, yep, it is crazy. I agree with you. Door. Is there a... Wait, how do I make a... Window? Wall? Oh, right, I can make a window from here. Wait. Oh. Wait, okay, yeah. Wooden window level 2. Wait, no, I need a... Oh, right, I, I, I should just make the wall frames first. That's <laughs> so. Wall frame. There you go. That's the first one. Then gotta make more of these. It's looking good. Making my own little shack here. Carpentry wall with a wall frame. Making the windows and filling up the walls, and we should be good. That should be the entire house. Then we gotta hunt some zombies in homes. Which is dumb. I'll see. By the way, short tip for you guys. If you find that you can't build uh, on this side, just press R and you can... Uh, it just makes you build on the other side instead. Instead of like hopping the fence. Or thinking you can't get to it. Yep. Let me get a stack of four. I do need to sleep soon. 
think I see some zombies. Do I see zombies? Nope. Unstack logs. So all. Take all of this. Then we're gonna sleep. Then continue building tomorrow. Not IRL, but I wanna finish at least the walls. Uh then get the door done. Then I'll be happy. Carpentry wall. Wooden wall frame. There you go. Wait, no, I wanted a window here. If I remember. Was it here or here? Carpentry wall. Okay, window done here. Uh, I need a door frame here. Carpentry wall, door, door frame. Don't have enough planks. Did I run out of planks or nails? No, I still have nails. Oh, I still have a log stack in my bag for no reason. Okay, take this. Carpentry wall. No, door, door, door. Carpentry door, door frame. Put this. Carpentry wall, wall frame. I think I wanted a. Uh... Okay, I wanted a. Uh window here okay so tree here so be a little bit more yo if a zombie comes up to me right now i'm dead I'm dead. Carpentry wall, wall frame. Stack one. Saw all. Don't think there's any zombies. Yo, am I dying? Uh, okay, we're we're gonna head back, drink some water, and we'll continue. This should be enough. Is it not considered... Wait, no, no. I didn't put a wall frame there. Let me take just a few more planks. Yeah, I need a door frame there until it's indoors. I think that's enough. Wait, wait, this this entire place is enclosed. 
Oh, guess I gotta upgrade the walls and that's it. Yeah. Let's put this all down. I could just drop it. Don't have any planks on here. Okay, sheet rope, drop on the ground. No sleep. Have to head back. Yeah, I didn't put a door frame there. Missed them. Wait, I did. Oh god, it's way too dark. Can't see shit. Yeah, I'm gonna sleep in the car. Oh wait, I can't. I'm way too thirsty. I might die of thirst. Uh, we're gonna head back. Imagine dying to thirst. Oh. That could have been real bad. Axe goes in here. I think I have enough logs to just close up the entire place now. Okay, for security, always put this on. We need to eat some food, remember? When you did that on the bar? What did I do again? Oh, you mean the sink? Man, it's been so long. Barricade the stairs. Oh yeah, dude. Ah uh, yeah. Uh, when were were we playing as? Was I playing as you? It's been a while. That might have been. No, it's not. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, up in West Point, right? Yo, that was a while ago and the way that we died oh my god the way the way that we died was just corpse sickness right that was it that was so bullshit yeah Torden's run was going so well <laughs> just because well like i was sleeping here and the corpses were here i didn't know the corpse sickness extends over walls and that's so dumb that's unfair I was like why am i getting so queasy <laughs> i got full queasy and i i couldn't even recover okay let's go <laughs> Did that emoji. Yo, I think I'm just gonna do a variation of the dead e dead cat emoji, but with RIP on the top. Just like text RIP. R went out. Just gotta just switch up the gas real quick. Grab. Eh? What? Oh. Because I had my fanny pack out. Yeah, no way I'm going to fit a gas can in a fanny pack. Yeah, I'm going to update that one. 
Do you feel it's better just leaving that one? Or should I? Yeah, or new one. I could use that one and just put RIP on top and use it as a different one. Or I just update and get rid of that one. Okay. Let's enclose this entire spot. Where's my bag? Oh, I dropped it. It's here. You could make a poll on Discord. Hmm. Yeah. You know, even if... Well, I guess you have the biggest, bigger say because you're one of the only uh, members right now. <laughs> You were here from the start, though, Thornton. Guys. <laughs> Yo, let's go. It's looking so good now. Join the Zara Club. Become a Zarite. You know, apparently Zarite is a type of, like, jewel or something. Yo, I get like 52 XP just making a wall. Let's go. Let's go, Thornton. Let's <laughs> saw all this. Yo, if I ever do like karaoke streams, it might just be like a members only thing. Copyright scares me so bad, dude. I don't want to lose this channel. <laughs> it, it was so hard trying to get it monetized. I think back in the day, the requirements weren't that bad. Maybe like 2000 hours so far time. And yeah, you could do that in like two weeks, but... Bro, like it took me like four months. Hell, like I've seen like some Reddit posts of people only getting monetized after trying really hard for like two years. Oh, we are more than, yeah. Gotta start pumping out a lot more videos, so. They are in the works, as we speak. Got a mechanics video coming up, and... Well, the low shot series, maybe I'll do one. So we can spam, yeah! <laughs> Yo, I wish that you didn't have to be a member to let people use that. Maybe like members would get exclusive ones, but I just like the emojis. I want everyone to use them. Yeah, like have basic on a chat. Because uh, Twitch has that, where you can just redeem channel points. Then you can just use the uh, emoticons that, you know, the guy the guy makes. But YouTube, you have to be a member for that. Ugh. I don't know why. Like, come on. Put, I, put all, I put in all the effort. I don't care if I, people pay or not. I just want people to use the emoticons. Cause I, I did like go on GIMP and actually like work on, uh, you know, emoticons for a bit. 
I mean, most of the credit goes to Vivi because I'm using his picture. Yeah. Vivi made the the cat that I'm using right now. That's the base for all the emoticons we're using. My place is looking kind of legit for something I'm building all by myself. It's not going to have a garage or anything. I might do that like outside. Oh, uh, carpentry, wooden wall. I might just barely have enough planks for all this. Because I covered this side. All, all the stuff is this side. Looking pretty legit. Yeah. Who knew? Who knew? Here, wooden wall. It does kind of suck that it's not level 3, but I can do that later on. I'm so close. I set out to do something and yeah, we're almost there. Okay, let's see, put this here. Carpentry, wooden wall. Almost there, almost there. Twitch has good features in terms of chat interactivity. Just really bad on getting like, you know, newcomers recommended and stuff. Wish that was different. <laughs> thirsty okay i'll finish these walls up and get some water but yeah it's so nice that this house has like a water source right inside oh i'm dying i'm dying i'm dying i'm dying oh just a little bit more just a little bit more How's my health? Uh, not good, not great, right? We've been better. Just needs, just need to grab a drink inside real quick, and we should be good. I'm 
some fish we good yeah why is it still considered outdoors so do i need to put windows for it to con be considered indoors that might be it i'm not sure do i have to put actual doors on maybe oh right because i don't have a freaking roof <laughs> Fuck. yeah i forgot about that pillars yeah it might it might be no roof yeah i don't have a roof yet Let me drop this. Okay. We actually finished this. That's a huge achievement. I'm gonna drink some water. Why is... Oh, I, I actually walked the whole entire way here. That's some... Oh yeah, definitely the roof. <laughs> Why do I hear nature? Yeah, because you don't have a freaking roof. <laughs> I thought that was a good... <laughs> It was like, hey, maybe, maybe I didn't close the place enough. Then you look up like, oh, uh, yeah, I can see the sky, dude. <laughs> okay. I can't really build a roof until I get level six, huh? Man, that's going to be rough. Uh, okay, we still have some water down here. Water bottles almost finished. I guess it's finally time for us to fill all this up. I take all the water bottles, go to the lake, fill them up, and turn on the oven. Why am I so heavy? Oh yeah, because I have all this sheet rope on me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. What's a good way to grind carpentry without it, without it feeling like excruciatingly slow? I just need one more level and I can build the roof now. Because, yeah, all I need is to make the staircase. Maybe I'll make it here. Hmm. Oh, I thought I was going to make it here, but now there's a window. What am I doing? Uh, yeah, what was I doing again? Oh, yeah, filling up water. Yeah, fill. Fill. Why can I wash so i can f fill wait so i can fish here but i can't fill water here that's weird i can wash myself so i never ha i never have to worry about not having a shower yeah we don't need to worry about showers let's go fill all It's so nice being next to a water source. Right next to the gas station too. Imagine carrying 14 water bottles in your backpack. <laughs> Bro. 
I could I could maybe walk like a hundred meters with that, and yeah, that's it. Uh, I'll I'll just be beached on the freaking floor at that point. Just just sitting down. Yeah, I break my back for sure. We did need that water refill. So it's all good. Let's see. Alright. Put all this in here. I need a freaking roof. Why does it take six carpentry to make roofs, man? I'm so close. Just like what 1600 xp so that's like making 32 walls okay that, that's maybe a lot <laughs> oh shit tainted water bottle all this ain't safe yet wait i have to boil it in microwave bro Wait, it has to be a microwave? Okay, that's dumb. Uh, I guess I'll... Okay, the canteen works. <laughs> uh, that's dumb. Okay, we gotta pick up a microwave. And what else? Uh, we'll sleep first, though. Pick this up. Sleep. You should turn off the tooltip telling you it's tainted water. No, no. You're falling asleep. We just gonna stream for a bit more, but yeah. Hope you have a good stream. Take care. Alright. Take care, Sorry. You have a good sleep, but yeah. Put this down. Leave a like, smash the subscribe button. <laughs> Lap that ass. I'm gonna smoke real quick. Okay. We need a microwave and what else? What do we need? Oh, it's, it's super dark out. We need a microwave and what else? Microwave, work on carpentry. We need a working doorknob. Uh, yeah. I think I disassembled like a ton of microwaves. Oh, where do I find a microwave then? Maybe like down south, but there should be some zombies on here. Not so sure if this is safe. Yep, zombies. Zombie. I see zombie. Yeah, it's way too dark to really engage in combat right now. What do I do, man? Oh, uh, it's, it's way too dark out. I don't like being here. 
oh, 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 oh. I don't want to die before I finish their freaking house. Please. I really want to be able to say like, Oh, I made it a hundred days with zombies that open freaking doors. With overweight and out of shape. Okay. Ah. Well, we're not really in a rush for a microwave. All we need is carpentry. But V chest doors. I don't know. It's it's gonna be rough trying to get to it. I think some zombies respawn here. Oh, that's a sprinter. This is the middle of the night. That's not ideal. Should I just wait for like 6 a.m.? Yo, Jimmy. Dude, every time I describe like my settings on Reddit, right? Uh, people keep saying like, who hurt you? <laughs> <laughs> My characters need sleep and food. Oh, he needs food, yeah. Let me get some food. He's just a little sad right now. Not really sleepy. Let me turn it off. Turn on it. Turn the car off. Yeah. A lot of people apparently on Reddit, like there's a lot of people that just think, oh, apocalypse is the hardest setting. Bro, it ain't. It ain't, bro, it ain't. <laughs> it's I'd say that's like normal mode at that point. That should be normal mode. Anything below that is kinda easy mode. Like like no shame, right? Like no shame if you want to play easy mode, whatever. Right? But you gotta say it how it is like uh anything other than apocalypse that's not harder is easy mode apocalypse is normal mode then sandbox where you turn up the settings like make them open doors and turn them into sprinters that's like actual hard mode okay i'm gonna rest up for a bit Can I sleep yet? Nope. So it's, it's already 6 a.m. Might as well just head out. I can take on fights, just not in the dark. I could carry a saucepan for water. Yeah. All of this is tainted. Let's take this. Okay. I'm enjoying 100% wandering sprinters. Yo, that sounds fun. Wandering sprinters at vault? Yeah, that's chaos. But there's no fence cheesing at all because, you know, trying to shove them when they're trying to climb just does not work out. It works like 10% of the time. And otherwise, you just face through pinpoint hearing, eagle eye. Yeah.
What are we looking for? Okay, we need to work on our carpentry. But we also need a microwave. I'm gonna reload real quick. Oh! Dude, whenever you're putting a magazine in, it does a weird thing where... Uh... Like, it steers one way and I was steering the left side. And it went like in a circle, that was scary. The horseshoe, okay. Okay, okay. Okay. I'm gonna check these houses out. But, oh god, that's a ton. Yeah, I didn't really clear out the south side, did I? Okay. You know what? I should. I should. But we still... Just to be on the safe side, I'm gonna run over the sprinters. Then I'll take care of the normal zombies. I mean, I could just fence cheese the sprinters. But, yeah, my guy has slow fitness, so it's a, it's a solid excuse not to do that. Where are they? I don't see them. Oh, and there's one in front of me. These guys are gonna migrate north eventually, so might as well take care of them now. Oh my god, that's a... Yeah, this, this is a lot. Eh. Eep. Eep. Okay, one down. How many more to go? I don't know. Is that guy not dead yet? Bruh. It might just be smarter if I just let them away from here. But... I do want to get some action in today. How many sprinters are on here? If I just fence cheese with the gun here, I, I could take him out. Okay, just gotta make sure this guy ain't a sprinter. Hello? Delivery, it's Amazon. Ow! Where are you going? Oh, 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 I have an idea. So if I get them to climb a fence while I'm in my car, that would be super safe, huh? It, maybe, maybe I, I, I don't know. Let's kill this guy. You die. Oh, I, I messed up. Dude, the turning on this thing is just horrible. Got him. Got him. Okay. This should be good now. Guess I'll kill them with my gun. Should I? Should I not? Probably a good time. Uh, it's just one sprinter down there. 
Did I just shoot him on foot? Let's see what. Got him. Zero aiming and I still got a headshot. What the heck? Just one more. I have to kill them eventually. I'll be a good time. Yeah, why do I feel like the turning on this truck is just horrible? Okay. When do I get off? I have to start shooting somewhere somehow. Don't want them to venture out to my area. Oh, wow. That's a ton. Yeesh. Come here. Wait, this isn't really a car I should be doing this in because I have an orange engine. I should just get them out of here. What am I doing? We, we got the Naruto runners on us now. I hope my tire doesn't blow out. Because I would die. Yo, okay, okay. Maybe, maybe I'm not doing the smart thing here. Because that's going to get me killed 100%. 100%. Oh my god, what am I doing? What am I doing? One, two, three. Three sprinters. If I get them right behind my car, I can just reverse on them. Okay, one out of commission. Okay. How many more? Just one more sprinter. Two more. Naruto Ami is gonna die. One, two. Buckle my shoe. Three, four. That guy ain't taking any damage. Wait, he died. Okay, perfect. No, I totally forgot that the population gets kind of crazy. And I've just been in a safe spot for way too long. I'm letting my guard down for sure oh wow yep that is a ton what am I doing yeah I gotta get them away from here and I'm using my bad car too so if something goes wrong this might be it uh One, two, look at my shoe. Okay. 
There has to be a way around. <sighs> what? Oh man, I just wanted to build. Now I'm I'm doing hort duty again. And just not having fun doing this over and over again. <laughs> Yeah, I, I gotta smoke a cigarette real quick though. Always have to. <laughs> if I had like high aiming, I could just take them all on, but yeah, having two aiming. Well, zero aiming is not ideal for a prolonged gunfight. Because trying to reload this is going to get me killed. Oh, I'm dumb. No, I'm going to die. Yep, th this car is beyond repair. Oh, no, no, no. The, the hood was good. So the engine didn't take any damage yet, I think. It might be close soon. Th this is a house. I could check it. I could check it out. What's down here? Yeah, houses. Where is this? Don't think I've seen this place before. Some wanderer. Ah, uh, so this is close to Maldra. This makes sense. Oh, this... this place... What is this? It's a farm. Farmhouse. Well, I'll stop here real quick. Got a few sprinters there. Got him. Don't feel tired? No. We're good. Reload. Perfect. I'm going to check what's inside this house. Uh, no microwave though. That sucks. Yo, I can still fill up my water. No VHS tapes. Radio. Okay.
Just a lot of farming stuff. Yeah, I don't really need. Hopefully, the zombies are far enough away from that home now. From my home. I can head up. What is wrong with me? <laughs> okay. One more collision and this engine's gonna be red. Let me check them out. Yeah, this connects right back to Ekron. Who knows? I might find the odd house here and there where I can find a microwave. Oh, it doesn't connect to Ekron. We'll find out. We'll be fine. Worst case, I just walk all the way there. It does have trees, so I could make the run. No. No. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay, speed demon, bad trait. <laughs> Definitely not me. I have really bad self control whenever you know you just can press W the entire time. You just go really fast. It's so satisfying, but it gets you in really bad spots where you just drive straight into cars. This car doesn't break fast enough. So being at a high speed is not good. And it doesn't turn well too. Let's see. Map. Yep. Ekron Road is down there. Yep. Yep. Straight to Ekron. Oh, this was my old truck. I think I burnt myself. Yeah, this was a burn area. I hope this place is safe. If there would be zombies, they'd be around the generator. I don't see him here. Okay. What was I doing? Okay, list of priorities. I have to grind my carpentry up to level 6, build a staircase, right? Then I'll be able to go up there. One way to grind carpentry that is kind of reliable is to break down fences, maybe. Like the small fences. Oh yeah. Before I get off, maybe I'll just look for a microwave real quick. Did I find one? B1 is up there. Oh, 
No microwave. No, not microwave. Wait, I need to eat. Eat all. Why doesn't plain sugar make you happy? You should. Maybe not from a, a mental state, but you know. Wouldn't it make you hyper? Let's eat this. Yeah, I think I've been here. One, two, buckle my shoe. Three, four. Buckle some more. Oh, zombie inside. I can't hear the zombie inside. I feel like I cleared the entire place out of microwaves, just leveling up my carpentry, uh, well, what, electrician skill? That might be it. That's why I'm not finding any. Let's check this place out real quick. I check this house out I'm getting sleepy that's not good wait I've already been here okay yep no luck finding microwaves at least on the north side and the south side is just overrun with zombies so I guess next stream we will we will be clearing out the south side of Ekron. Then, yeah, we'll be able to finish that entire place. We'll see how it goes. Wait, I should pick... No, 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 no. I shouldn't pick up a flamingo. Why would I do that? Ah, let's check this. Micro yes, we got a microwave. Gotta eat this. Just the moment that I was gonna give up, we found it. Let's go. Dancing dead wrong. Nice. Heading back home. Mission accomplished. You know, on the bright side, I killed a ton of sprinters by running them over. I let them sort of away from the place. So all is not lost. It's... Uh, I calculated my moves. <laughs> okay. Microwave done. Let's put this up here. Where do I put microwave? Maybe here. Oh man, I, I really want to finish the lake house though. It's going to take a while before I do that. Made it out in one piece.
there. All of the water goes in there. Sweet, sweet. This is taking a while. Device options. Settings. Which one is for... Oh wait, this is defrosting. Do I put it here? Oh yeah, there you go. Turn off. Oh, finally. We won't have a water problem. Okay, sweet. Let me close this up. We'll sleep and that's it for the stream. Yeah. That's crazy. We actually made a freaking base. Wait, wait, no, no, no. I'll, I'll sleep then sit at the freaking house. That way, it's going to be a better recap because we're next to the thing that we worked the most on today, which was the house. Let me take a cigarette smoke. Level 6 carpentry feels like a lot though. How am I gonna get that by next room? Unless I find a VHS. Or I could just grind it out. gonna sit rest take my time oh it's really raining out there bro Smoke cigarette. Still can't sleep. Take this. Move it on over. Yeah, nature. Yeah, I really want to live on on the actual uh, lake house, so I feel more in tune with nature too. Because this. This playthrough was supposed to be like living in the wild and stuff. So at least I'm on a lake, right? <laughs> Close enough. Smoke some more cigarettes. Is a downstairs door busted? No, it ain't. Okay. Oh, I broke a headlight. Um. So is this. And yeah, we shall end the stream in this building. It's a shame that there's no roof yet, but yeah, next stream that's going to happen. All right, yo, that, that was a lot of progress. Like, when I started the stream, this entire thing was not here. We set up a generator too. Have a fence. Yeah. So next stream goal is to set up the second floor. Maybe set up a balcony too. Maybe balcony up here. But yeah. Let's see. We are one month, nine days and 21 hours in our sprinter. Well, random zombies run where they can open doors and <laughs> with wandering zombies. So I'd say that's a good note to end the stream. Thank you so much, guys, for tuning in. And I'll see you next time on next stream. See you. Take care. 
and goodbye. If you haven't done so already, do leave a like. It really helps with the video. Or you can leave a comment on any of the streams. Yep. If I can get this Living Wild series to really take off, it would mean the world to me. I. Right. You guys take care. Bye bye.